fucking come in they're like dude new year's stream bro what the fuck and i'm sitting here like man it's a goddamn friday and when tomorrow comes around it's gonna be a saturday like i don't know what else to tell you like i these days mean nothing to me like <laughs> i i like it's just days He's already mad. Well, if I'm a little bit, if I sound a little bit fucking amped up today, it's because for a second holiday season in a row, someone other than me tracked COVID into my house. And I'm only finding out like five days later, eyes twitch. My booster I got three or four weeks, like three weeks ago. So I should be double good, but at the same time, I might get sick again. I think I got COVID last time it happened too. Because the choice thing about it is that no one ever actually uh, knows that they were contagious until like a week after they were already contagious. And then by that point, it's not like anyone could have done anything different to not catch it. So I'm like kind of just sitting here like shrug. What, what, I, ugh, it's just annoying. But, yeah. It's whatever. I'm... I'll be fine. I, I, if I did catch it already once before, then it's nothing that I can't just do again. But I'm just more, like, annoyed because it always... It's such a fucking... It's just, at, like, two years in a row. Like, one person has, for some reason, just done it twice. Like, not the same person, but, like... Two years in a row, someone has walked into the house and just been like, hey, hey, and then they come back a week later and like, oh, by the way, also, I, I had COVID that whole time. I was, I was uh, sick the whole time. Oops. Uh, so. Yeah. There's not even like a point in me going to get tested to see if I did catch something. Because, no, that way it doesn't change anything for me. So it's just like, well, whatever, whatever. I'll be fine. But uh, yeah, only reason it annoys me, honestly, is um, because my job requires me to have a functional voice and lungs. And unlike some people that can, if they say worked at home and were sick, could still do things, I just can't. <laughs> When I, when I did get like the worst of the shit last year through, around like Christmas time, I was also like, yep, yeah, done so for a couple of days and like took some time off. But uh, yeah, I don't like taking forced time off, you know, is my issue. So I don't like forced vacations unless I got banned from Twitch. All right, if I got banned from Twitch for it, different story. I'll take that, but like, Bunch of freaking BS. But yeah, a bunch of new. Uh, there's been two updates to this game since the last time I played, so there's a bunch of new arcade games. So we're gonna we're gonna spend a uh, couple hours and play some coin game. I don't really have, honestly. Um, I have stuff I want to do that's sort of larger scale, but um, I didn't really want to do it on on uh, New Year's Eve, cause anything that I'd be running really. Like, any of the big stuff I'd be doing would be a longer-running stream. And, uh, frankly, I'd like to be out of here before, like, everyone's celebrating the New Year's whatever the fuck. It means nothing to me, but I'd rather not be streaming at that point, so. We're gonna do, like, a four-hour thing, and then I'm done. Does anyone know why there's no VOD for yesterday's stream? I deleted it. I don't, I, it, it boggles my mind. Like, I, I I know you're just curious, but if there's no VOD, it's got deleted. It's gone. Like, I don't need to explain it to every single person that walks in for hours. Like, just assume that if the VOD's gone, there's a reason why it was removed. And just move on. Because it makes the mods' lives a lot easier, and it makes mine easier. Okay? I didn't want it there anymore, so I got rid of it.
because I have to watch the mods copy and paste messages to everyone that asks over and over again as they file in and continue to ask the same question. Hmm, maybe the Discord would have the answer. It does! It absolutely does! <laughs> On top of that, the uh, title of the stream had the answer until literally this stream started. But people don't see those. But, uh... Yeah. The answers are out there. The answers are out there. People have been asking the Discord when it's written. I don't think people use the stream schedule thing. <laughs> I, I don't. I don't think as many people use the title of the stream and stream scheduling as much as I think they do. Sometimes, because <laughs> it's definitely a definitely a lot of a lot of questions. I don't think people use them. I, I I've hoped people have used them because I've been doing it for like two years but sometimes I'm not so sure. Maybe I should just do what other streamers do and ignore every single chat message that's a question forever. Maybe that should be my New Year's resolution, like going into 2022, is just never answer a question ever. It'd probably make me happier. Dude, I already started, and it already made me happier. I already got a real stinker that came in, and instead of answering it, I just looked at it and ignored it. And then it scrolled by, and I didn't have to say anything. Bro, this should be the new me. I'll just let other barely informed chat members answer for me with incorrect answers. That's what I'll do. Like the time that someone asked recently on the Discord if when I was going to play CDDA again and a person replied by saying I was waiting for a tile set. I have no idea where they got that information from, but sure, I'm waiting for a tile set before I play Cataclysm again. I don't know where that information came from. I have no idea. But, um... Yeah. <laughs> I'll just let... I'll just let people make up answers. Oh, yeah. Tomato definitely prefers Outer Worlds to Wilds. True. True. Oh, my God. Oh my god. Bro, I know that you've only messaged it twice, but you've been following me for uh, at least six months, and you should know that um, adding me once for a game you want me to play and then sending an unadded message of an exact replica of that same message uh, is going to get annoying. I'm not going to respond to your message, but you know who you are. Stop it. I should not see that. Cease. Cease. If you have a recommendation, you can put it in Discord. Don't at me. In the stream. Thanks. Man. I can't wait for Slime Rancher. When is this a new one coming out? Because I actually want to play that game again. But I... There's not much reason to replay the old one, ever. I don't, I don't think it's a replayable game. I think it's a you do it once and see everything and then you never come back to it ever again, in my opinion. So uh, I've been kind of just sitting here twiddling my thumbs waiting for the new one. Imagine only ranching slimes. Well, there's all that bullshit with like, you can get bees to do things, but it's like, 
That's that point where the game fucking reveals its dark underbelly endgame, which is grinding resources, which I don't uh, want to do. Yeah, it's not. It's just not me. I'm a. I'm a different kind of person. It says 2022. That's like a day away or some bullshit. Dude. It still feels like it still feels like when something says 2022, it's like, oh, that's two years away. It's fucking weird. Isn't it like in 2023, the year when some gigantic fucking meteor is supposed to like skid past the atmosphere of the earth? And like everyone, uh, like we're all gonna fucking blow up. Isn't that like 2023? Isn't that coming? And every single time and someone asks an astronomer about it, they're like, yeah, it's gonna be like a fucking one in 10,000 chance we fucking explode. And like everyone's like, oh, okay. But again, I guess that's every year. <laughs> Nibiru. Finally coming, Nibiru. Yeah, but it's actually gonna happen this time. Look, dude. The moon is also wobbling. Yeah, but that's been that's gonna be wobbling for a long time. And you know what? Whatever. Yeah, Betty White died. That fucking sucks. But, um, hey, at least she lived to 99. That's, like, it's not as depressing as, like, some, like, someone dying at, like, 50. Like, that's someone that lived a full fucking life that most people will likely never reach. So, pretty good. Pretty, pretty good run there. Pretty good run there. I, for one, plan to be out of here by, like, 85 absolute maximum, because the way my body feels right now, chat, I think around, like, 60, my body is going to be pretty much at the same fucking physical, like, level as someone in their hundreds. I'm crumbling, so I don't know how the hell anyone in their, like, 90s going to hundreds is, like, able to fucking function or do anything, really. My retirement plan is to die in the water wars. Dude! <laughs> it's a real good way to look at it, dude. Die in the water wars. What? No, gang. The water wars. The moisture battles? When, uh... When we officially run out of renewable water and we all have to kill each other for our water supplies. The uh, water wars. It's not hard to think about. It's like kind of like a Mad Max kind of situation. But that's not really a retire. I would not describe someone as retiring if they fucking die. Is the thing. Like if you, if you are in the water wars with me and I'm driving down the street looking for water and you point there's water over and your head gets ripped off by like a big concentrated jet stream of like hose water from like a like a fucking weaponized fire truck driving by i'm not gonna be like damn retirement huh i'm gonna be like oh damn that guy just got cut in half by a concentrated beam of water from the water war yeah you don't expire you don't retire you expire like there's a difference what the fuck is this tangent dude do you not fucking listen to the things I goddamn say before you type stupid bullshit out of your goddamn keyboard, you little bitch? I'm talking about the water war. God. Mods, add that as a mod note that this person doesn't know how to fucking listen or read. Add that as a mod note. <laughs> 
on Serenox. I want them. I want. I, I, I want it on their fucking profile. 2022 is the year of no more chat bullshit. All right. We're determined to sell the fat off of this fucking of this chat. We're getting rid of some of the bullshit this year. Twenty twenty one, I was too nice. Twenty twenty two, I'm bringing it back to the classic. Bringing it back to the classic. If we're finally getting rid of the bullshit, does that mean you're going tomato? Omega lol got him. You forgot to add an E after the your. You fucking. Mods, add it to their notes. They don't know the fucking difference. Time them out, add it to the notes, baby. Add an apostrophe R E. Oh, boy. Mm. Mm. Another one, Omega Lull. 2022 is the year of permanent records, fuckers, all right? Twenty twenty two year of the alt account. <laughs> twenty twenty two year of the fucking alt account. Where everyone tries to desperately hide from me. Look, I'm just why I'll be honest, I'm I'm gonna be a little more annoyed today because I had to wake up and be told I might have COVID again for no like fault of my own again. So I'm a little bit fucking I'm a little bit on edge today going into this one. It's kind of hard to it's kind of hard to be uh happy like that. Hey, Bro Broxky Beat, thanks for the five gifted subs. The Twitching Squirrel, thanks for the five as well. Billy Pop Cletus, five. On top of that, thanks. Eight Bit Zig, ten gifted subs. On top of that, thank you, thank you, thank you, dude. You're not 100% isolating yourself from the universe? No, let me make something clear. I am. <laughs> That's the problem. I am. I go upstairs one time for the holiday. And at that point is when I am like, f I find out that the one time I did something to expose myself to COVID, I, that I could have got it. Ugh. Just never leave your house again, bro. It's over. <laughs> I basically am a bubble boy. The only time I went out was to get the fucking booster. I can't survive like this anymore. I've been living off of filtered oxygen for the last two years. My AC unit just refilters oxygen. I haven't breathed outside air in two years. I just keep recycling it. When I put my hand outside of my room two days ago, my skin burned. Because I touched I, I, I touched a bunch of particulates my body was no longer prepared to touch. My skin started burning and smoking. I started screaming. What if the takeout is the source? I can tell you one thing that I've gotten very good at with um, the, the, the pandemic and uh, takeout orders. And it is being able to very quickly get rid of everything that came in the takeout thing, dispose of it, destroy it and have all the food perfectly spread on a plate like nothing happened there's nothing the row route thanks for the 20 gifted subs thanks isn't it a stereotype that gingers burn easy stereotype <laughs> you mean proven fact 
Yes, matter of fact, it is. That is not a stereotype. That is uh, literally a fact. It's one of my genetic disadvantages I took when I, uh, when I was born. A permanent debuff, if you will. Bro, you gotta reroll. Nah, because the thing I got in exchange, and this is also a somewhat documented thing, is uh, my pain, ginger pain threshold is pretty high in comparison to most other people, uh, apparently. And I definitely see it. Man, some people I see out there, and I did see out there, especially when I was like growing up, are like pathetic little baby people. Like pathetic little baby people. And like, I, I could take a lot. Poro said, bro, pain hurts, okay? Look, all I'm saying is that I have at multiple points in my in my life shattered my pinky and then proceeded to complete the game I was playing in a in like gym or whatever before I actually had it dealt with. Like multiple times I've been like, ow, this sort of hurts, but I'm gonna keep playing. And then only after I was done when I'd be like, that's wrong, <laughs> that's wrong. That's wrong. Pain can't stop him, chat. Remember that. It can't. Well, it can. Like, it It can. It absolutely can. But, like... <laughs> yeah, it's gotta be emotional pain. You gotta call me names and eventually I'll just start slowing down. You gotta call me enough mean things and I'll just really slow down. The emotional, there's no pain threshold for emotional. Call a man a taffer enough times and he'll, he'll slow down like anyone will. Gingers have skill issues. Holy shit, he's actually right. Research has shown that people with red hair perceive pain differently than others. They're more sensitive to certain types of pain that can require higher doses of some pain-killing medications. However, studies suggest that the general pain tolerance may be higher. It is absolutely higher. That or I know a lot of people with very low pain tolerance. People with red hair also respond more effectively to opioid pain medications requiring lower doses. Yeah, well. It's because of the lack of souls. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking funny. 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 <laughs> Look, all I know is that is say I wanted to take, well, look, the problem is, gang, painkillers don't actually help me ever. I've never, in reality, like I've taken a lot of ibuprofen in my day and like headache medication, all that shit. It don't fucking matter. It, like, it, I have to take like a, because I'm tall too, right? I'm like 6'2 or 6'1. I don't know, I haven't, I, I don't think I've shrunk. So I think I'm around six, one and a half or some bullshit. So I'm already big. So the base dose that stuff tells you to take for like painkillers is nothing. Like it's never going to reach my whole body. Cause I'm big. And I'm also a, like a red haired guy. So ibuprofen just doesn't fucking ever do anything for me. Like doctors are always like, have you been taking ibuprofen for this? I'm like, fucking no. Like I, I can, you want me to take like four? Of them, do you want me to take? Because I don't feel anything until four. Like I, nothing, absolutely nothing changes physically at all for me, unless I've taken four. And then you have this doctor that's like a psycho and he's just like, well, then take six. <laughs> and he disappears into the mist. And that happens every time. If I, if they ask me about like have how much ibuprofen have I taken, I say I take like four because I like I'm big and I've got a high pain like threshold. They'll be like, then take six of them. And if I say I've been taking six, the guy will be like, well, take eight then. I don't fucking know. Stop if you start foaming at the mouth. But 
you know what does go through me like a fucking freight train every single time? Benadryl. Don't matter. Do one, one thing that'll always get to me, I can take a half of one of those and I'll be like, ooh, clocked out. <laughs> time to take a break. <laughs> I, can, I can have a little half of one of them in my body and oh. So my I, dude, I try to avoid taking Benadryl because obviously, while it's not necessarily habit forming as in like addictive, you can just get into the habit of saying it's a lot easier to fall asleep if I take something to make me fall asleep faster. But um. <clears throat> Man, when I've been dealing with like allergies and I take some of that Benadryl, dude, I know for sure I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna either A, have a really nice sleep, or B, have like some crazy fucking dreams tonight. I try, I don't take Benadryl that much anymore because the last two times I've taken it in the last like year, I have had like psycho dreams, like insane maniac dreams. And I don't know why, because it didn't used to be a problem, and all of a sudden I started having, like, insane maniac dreams. And at the end of the last one, my body forgot to breathe. And I, like, ended up waking up, stumbling out of bed, falling to the ground, and I couldn't inhale. And it was, like, fucking terrifying. And I don't know if it was the same thing or what, but it was, like, fucking absolutely bizarre. I had no idea what was happening to me. And I was like, yep, no, nah, <laughs> no more! No more! No! And then I stopped taking it, then I never took any more, it never happened again. Yeah, nothing in this world is more fucking innately terrifying than waking up <clears throat> in your bed, being fully mobile, but your body won't breathe. Like, that was possibly the scariest thing that happened to me in, like, years. That happened, like, two years ago. Like, a year ago or something. And I was like, oh, boy! <laughs> It's not like a fucking, I thought, I, I thought some kind of wild horror monster, like a fucking alien had crawled down my throat. I, 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 I thought I was gonna, I thought I was donezo. I was, I was convinced. I get sleep paralysis all the time. Yeah, well, sleep paralysis doesn't fuck with me because I'm incredibly powerful and no demon would ever dare show their face. I looked around while my throat was closed up and I didn't see nobody. There was no one in the room with me, because if there was, the last thing I would have done before I suffocated and died while unable to inhale was strangle them to death too. All right, the last thing my arms would have done was all my joints would have locked up from rigor mortis as I suffocated while also strangling the demon. They'd have to, they'd need the fucking jaws of life to fucking pry my fingers from their throat, all right? He's just doing his job. No, I've never had a sleep paralysis demon, and I don't think they dare show up in my house. Also, there's no comfortable places to stand in my room. If you were like a, if you were a sleep paralysis demon, I feel like you'd be like, ooh, that's not gonna work. Nah, this isn't a good spot. Yeah, no, there's no, there's no real clearing here. This spot is already taken by a chair with something on it that looks like a demon. It's too obvious. He probably looks over there every day and thinks there's a demon in his room, which I do. Uh, couldn't be there. They'd probably just run out of spots and then go home. <laughs> Gotta tidy up if you're having guests over. Look, dude, <clears throat> why would I make it? Why would I make my room more accessible for demons? Living as tomato must be a never ending nightmare, says a chat member. I'm not so sure about that. I've got a pretty good deal going up until two days ago or three days ago when someone tracked fucking COVID into my house. But, uh, you know, up until then, 
Living as me was a pretty good deal. Sleep paralysis demons didn't fuck with me. I got to eat food when I wanted. I have fiber internet. I'm a top 300 streamer. I haven't had a haircut in two months and I'm starting to go crazy from my hair touching my ears. So that's a that's a con. I'm trying to think of cons so it doesn't sound like I'm just constantly winning. Uh, the, my hair is touching my ears now and it's starting to drive me insane. Um, just yesterday I forgot to shave my face and I only shaved my neck so I'm getting the evil villain goatee and I didn't even plan on it. I just like only shaved my neck because my neck was itchy. And lately I've lost control of my life and the only time I shave anything is if I'm itchy. So my neck was itchy so I was like, well I'm shaving my neck now. And I forgot to shave my face and now I have a goatee. And now I'm entering my evil villain arc. Face, you mean your chin? Dude. Imagine not having such powerful eyebrows that they don't actually- that they're not actually capable of bridging to your fucking cheeks. Mine are- I have- I have some wild hair situations going on in my face chat, like, I can- My eyebrows can fucking bridge to my cheeks, it's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. Like, I- <laughs> I've got like caveman hair, dude. I didn't notice it before. And then like recently I was like, well, my eyebrows are getting down there. And I was like, wait a minute, whoa, they're almost like reaching my sideburns, these fucking things. Oh. 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 I mean, I sh the second I saw it, I shaved it in like a, 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 an act of defiance against my monkey ancestry. But, um, you know, for a minute I was thinking about going full Neanderthal for a couple weeks. See how I feel. I got nothing to do. I got nothing to prove and no one to impress. Okay, I don't use a webcam. And then I remembered I have to go, I have to go on webcam contractually by Joe when I do Godforged on Sunday. And then I start sweating. Because I was like, fuck. He's gonna yell at me. He's gonna yell at me. You pull them with tweezers. I have a fucking, I, no, I'm not gonna fucking pluck my, ugh. I don't need to do, ugh. no thank you. Why not freak, that is what you do. There's no visual difference between me plucking every single individual hair and me just shaving the spot really quickly. Yeah, I might have to shave it more often. But there fucking is zero visual difference. No, there is. Oh, have you guys checked my face for me lately? Are you sneaking around in some kind of air duct I couldn't find in my house? Is that where my food goes? Is that where all the scraps of food I leave in my kitchen fucking go? It's because someone is sneaking up to my, like, into my room every night to check my face to see if there are visual differences between the two on my face, you little freaks. So otherwise, uh, other way, in other uh, news, uh, Lamar, thanks for the uh, thousand bits. You're one of the only not freaks here. Nothing weirder than being told by people the way something is on your body for you. <laughs> In 2021, it's nothing weirder than that. Nah, dude, let me tell you what. The 2022 meta. Nah, that's been going on forever. That's not a 2022 thing or a 2021 thing. <laughs> I was the frog. What? Dude, your head is wrong. It should be like mine. What?
Look, dude, all I'm saying is that if one of you was in the vents, you wouldn't be the horror monster, all right? You'd be the fucking person in the horror game trying to avoid the monster, okay? You'd regret it. You'd regret it pretty quickly. Because I, when I get a bug in my room, or something that ain't supposed to be in there, I will hunt that thing down till the ends of the earth to take its life. Okay? And that applies to any living thing in my house that shouldn't be in there. I will... I will destroy you. Happy birthday, tomato. Thanks. It is my birthday. There actually was something fucking weird. I've got this little, like, crawl space in a corner of my room that, like, is covered by, like, a board. Like, it's, like, a, in the wall. And, like, you pull the crawl space out. And, like, you, a full person could be in there, but I've always been paranoid, so I have a couple mouse traps in there. Because I'm like, what if, like, a raccoon or, like, a squirrel got in there? So I have these, like, mouse traps in it. And, like, a couple weeks ago, something tripped it. And I was too afraid to check. And I was like, oh god, but I gotta check, because what if there's something attack- what if I- what if I got something and it's like been dead in there for like weeks? And I like opened it up to check, and all there was was like a little bit of fur, except it was way too much to be a squirrel or like a chipmunk or something small. But there's no room in the crawl space for anything larger than a squirrel or a chipmunk to get in. But if it was a squirrel or a chipmunk, I straight up fucking ripped its whole pelt off with the with the mouse trap. But yet it did not bleed. There's some kind of monster in my walls. And I I, I haven't really thought about it since. Cause I like I look I crawled in there because I like grabbed it and I was like looking around with a flashlight. I'm like, there is no fucking space for anything larger than a squirrel to get in here. I only anticipated squirrels. So now the crawl space is basically bolted over. I've got it wedged. I've got a thing like a chair wedging it to the wall, like the little, like a hatch for it. And I've taped it. <laughs> and I've still got the traps active in there. And I'm, I'm not ever going in there again. Unless I start smelling the smell of something having been dead in there for weeks, I'm not going back in there. Because I got spooked. I was, like, scared there was a monster. We have mouse house mice skittering around our house. I don't get many animals. I mean, like, I got, I got a mouse. I've had two mice in my house ever since we moved in. Uh, that I could see. And, um, both of them were dispatched in equally depressing ways. Um, whatever this thing was, was not a mouse. Whatever it was. I hope I never have to find out what it was, to be honest, because it seemed... Look, dude... It, all I know is that if whatever tripped that mouse trap was PO'd enough, it could have easily just slammed right. And this is the thing that scares me. It could have easily slammed right into the hatch, popped the wall out in the corner of my ha like my room, and gone in a fucking vicious rampage after just having like the fur of its ass ripped off by like a mouse trap, just like fucking ripped me to shreds, like a giant raccoon, like a raccoon. Could have just like, and it was like charged at me and killed me. Like around the corner on stream while I was live. Like that's what wigged me out was I was like, I have to barricade this thing because I do not want like a fucking monster to bar like barrel through my office when it's, when it gets, you know, unceremoniously shaved by my mouse trap. Funny death bit. 
It's Poro. You hurt Poro. You don't even... <sighs> Poro is not in there. I don't... I just looked up Poro because I've never looked up Poro. It's just like a ball. Nah, Poro would have fucking completely been destroyed by the mousetrap. Like, hands down, I would have found Poro's fucking corpse in that crawl space. That wouldn't have been, there wouldn't have been a Poro in there. Yeah, they'd be dead. Actually, Poro's Q gives him CC break. Mods, as of now, Poro said is blacklisted. Someone finally ruined it. We're blacklisting the word. Someone actually made it a league thing. It's time to end this once and for all. <sighs> Not even removing the emote, just blacklisting. It's a Twitch global emote. I can't just remove it. I can't just remove it. I, I'm not allowed to do that. I can't just email Twitch and be like, take it off. Take it away. Poro's extra sad. <laughs> Dude, you're not allowed to use Poro sad if you don't play League, bro. You never understand why he's sad. So he is only sad because of League, right? Because I don't know. I'm pretty happy a lot of the time in my life. I mean, I'm pretty, I'm in a pretty good mood a lot of the time. The only thing that I really know for sure could bring me down is Poro, is like this league, like the kind of, I think it would be league. I think it'd be like league stuff. So, wait, no, you didn't. What the fuck is that? All right, mods, re-enable Poro sad, take away Kekheim, okay? Ban that one. No one's gonna worry about that one when it's gone. Re-enable Poro sad take away Kekheim. I've changed my mind. There are worse things out there. Yuck. What was that? Where are these like there's some bad emotes out there, huh? Like there's some fucking real stinkers out there that no one really knows exists. There's some, there's some real stinkers. But I still think the worst emote on Twitch is the horny imp emote. The horny, like, little devil. Like, the smile. I think that's the worst emote on the internet. Yeah. I still hate that one. Who's <laughs> the... Who has, like, the really bad one? <laughs> so everyone's posting the right one, then one person posts one that's, like, this weird, like, fucking off-brand version. And, like, if you look at... Chad Arino doesn't even have the right versions on it, so people are looking at... Anyone that's on like the stream watching like the visual chat roll by, they're not even seeing the one that I'm talking about that's the bad one. Because they're seeing these crusty, fucking gross things instead. Emotes, all emotes suck. I remember back in the old days when we didn't have them. When you had to actually say what you meant. I remember back in the old days. Back when society was pure.
I feel sad. All caps, yell someone. No one asked. <sighs> 2022 is gonna be the year of shutting the fuck up and keeping it to yourself, motherfucker. All right? I think we've done enough sharing for a lifetime on the internet. It's time to start holding it in until it explodes violently, all right? In public outbursts. It, 2021 was a year of a lot of talking, a lot of sharing. It was a hard year. 2022 is gonna be a year of holding it all in so that 2023 could be real freaky, all right? Let's get it started. We're gonna make we're gonna make 2022 real quiet, so 2023 can be crazy. A whole year of bottling it up. Hey, Nanny Res, thanks for the f 10 gifted subs. Thanks, thanks. And then 2024 will be like a like a hangover year. Yeah, chat's got a good point. Yeah. I'll be long dead by 2022, says Jerry Bumblenuts. Hey, Jerry, read the fucking title of the stream and get the heck out of here before I have to make you, all right? Thanks. Come back tomorrow. <laughs> if you're alive. <laughs> that's fucked up. That's, that's fucked up. Jerry, Poro, sad. Dude, I don't know if Voicebox can hear this, but I'm thinking about cracking open Vintage Story in 2022. 2022 is going to be the year of reopening Vintage Story for a session. I'm thinking it's almost time. I wonder if he can sense it. What the fuck, dude? That was someone you didn't even know. Dude. I don't know what to tell you. I have to, There's only one thing I have control over in this world, and it's my title on my Twitch stream. Okay. I could change it to say, frick you, person who said that, if you prefer. Besides, I saw that person type earlier today. I saw Jerry say already at one point, dude, what the fuck? Why is he coming at me? He knew exactly what was going to fucking happen if he showed himself. He already, rem he already talked about it. And he then willfully fucking... Responded. He knew what he was walking into. He was aware of it. Remove one word from the title at random every 14 minutes. Look, dude. Stream toxicity rising 7,000%. You know what's kind of funny? I do want to play that game again. <laughs> the streamer life simulator game by those just fucking... That game was so dumb. Scrabble word ban stream. I do still want to do that, but I have no idea how to execute a stream like that. I don't even, I don't even think it's possible. I really don't. I don't think it's possible. 
because here's the problem. No one will get the memo. People don't get the memo as to like, like anything that happens on my stream, like the day before. That stream would be funny for the people that were there at the time, but I think I'd have to delete every single part of it by the next day. Like it would only be like, oh, the, the words could only be blacklisted for the stream because no one would understand what the fuck was happening a day later. There'd be someone like fucking like talking about it every 10 seconds. Where well, they had it coming. Nah. Not worth it. As much as I too like um, confusing people and making them miserable on my stream, I can't. There are certain things that I that simply must stay the same, and too much change is a bad thing. For instance, there are certain words that I have blacklisted that I will never allow to be enabled, because enabling them would simply allow you to uh, get it all out of your system right away, which makes things miserable for me. Um, so I'm never, I'm never, ever, ever, ever enabling the word. It took like two years for me to allow you to say like Apple again. I don't even know if Apple is allowed. I know FTL is, maybe. Maybe Apple is allowed. All right, Ma, it's not Bennett. <laughs> no, I'm, jo I'm joking, I'm joking, don't. Literally 1984! Literally! Who has read 1984 in chat? We've talked about this and I know for a fact it's almost none of them. Like, I, I know for a fact it's almost none of these fucking people. They just say things. Like, I read it. I know what it's about. Prove it. Let me go get my book report right now. I have it, I have it hung up. I have it framed and hung up. I have every single A grade I ever gotten anything in my whole fucking childhood hung up and framed on my walls. So if anyone ever asks if I can prove if I did something, I can pull out the fucking report I did. And show everyone. That's sad? No, it isn't. All two of them? Shut up! Insubordination. Insubordination and, and, and general rudeness. Add it to their fucking, like, mod notes. Add it. This is the year of uh, fucking... Comprehensive mod note reports on every single fucking person in the chat. The year of the permanent record. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, yes. There will be, there will be a test at the end of 2022. But yeah, chat, I don't know. I don't know how much longer I want to hang out with you today before I switch to the game, because, like, I'm sitting here, like... You're, you've reached it. You've degraded to just doing the message deleted bit. We both know you didn't type anything worth deleting. <laughs> it's not hard to tell. Like, it's probably just about time to get into the video game, to be honest. Come on, man. 
<laughs> Come on, man. Poor old Shad. I'll only say one thing, okay? If I ever say anything ever again, it'll be that Poro said is an above average emote. As far as emote quality is concerned, I would put that one at above average. Compared to some of the other trash that Twitch has let fucking, like, just squeeze its way onto this site, that one's not bad. This game again, streamer. Did someone just fucking seriously come into the chat and try to act like Coin Game isn't one of the best stream games on the entire market? Did someone seriously walk into the chat in public and fucking try and posture themselves and say that like stream like Coin Game isn't like one of the best ones? You just try to act like you didn't like Coin Game in front of all these people? LMAO, I forgot Komodo is still banned. I don't understand why. Look, if you are a... All right, hang on. I'm looping back around. If you're out there, some kind of sicko freak, all right? Some kind of freak out there. And you are for real using Komodo hype when the Twitch staff were so kind as to copy and paste... The emote to Pog Champ. It's weird. It's weird. If anything, you should instead uh, complain to your local uh, Twitch representative about uh, the fact that for some reason Komodo hype still exists. Um. In, look, all you gotta do is get rid of Komodo Hype and replace it with Gek W. Because I would say Gek W is a premium emote. I would describe Gek W as a premium emote. That is a that is a premium emote. And instead we have two exact copies of emotes. Okay? Emote tier list stream. Well, it's gonna be a lot of stinkers and then like seven good ones And if it's only global twitch, it's gonna be a lot of stinkers and like three good ones There's like so many Bad shit emotes on twitch that no one has ever seen before like they have never been used like no, like a fucking server in Twitch HQ ignites into flames when someone uses it because that entire drive in the server hasn't had a little fucking current of electricity pass through it in like a decade. Like, you're seeing a lot of these now, and you're gonna all of a sudden see a, like, a fucking news article that a Twitch, like, server room burst into flames. In, like, a, like, an hour. Because someone started pulling all the old data. Oh my god! Oh my god! Someone just typed in J can style. Art the server just can't fucking take it, and it just bursts into flames. You're gonna have like fucking five report helicopters circling around the place. Oh, that actually lagged me for a bit when I chose one of them. I, dude, it's bad. Some of these are awful, dude. Wait, which one is just tomato? The ringer is just tomato. That, it looks nothing like me at all. That looks nothing like me at all. <laughs> oh yeah? Really, it doesn't look anything like me. 
It is you. No. No. Red haired guy equals tomato. Yeah, I look closer to, uh. I look. Uh, yeah, I don't look anything like that guy. I hate CDs, the ringer. Can, can we? All right, blacklist that fucking e vote. Get that one out of there. I don't like jokes. 2022 is the year of no more picking on me. <laughs> uh. It's been fun. Maybe 2022, maybe we'll do this fun thing. No, I can't. I actually can't in good conscience do that. I was going to say in 2022, we could just do this new thing where we uh, we delete the whole blacklist. And we just sort of re do a redo every year. But I, uh, I, I, I can't, I can't do that. I simply couldn't. Wow, the one per the people I wasn't expecting, I was not expecting mods to immediately go, fuck yeah, do it, freak. Like, I was really expecting, like, uh, because that's, that, that's work for you. Like, that's, that's cr actually psycho. Yeah, I'd say the I'd say that the most cursed emote on Twitch, if I'm gonna be honest, is um I think I got get I, like 2021, some 2021 <laughs> reviews going out into 2022 this year. Uh, most cursed user emote. I'm uh, unless I'm given uh you know a like new information. I gotta give it to Gmart uh, for his just un unbelievably crusty Gmart gross emote that is just so bad, like unbelievably crusty, like straight out of the dumpster, scraped right from the bottom. You had to get like a fucking like steel wool to scrape it from the bottom of the dumpster. And that's what came off, and it's barely fucking cropped properly. There's like white fuzz on the sides. It's not smoothed. He, he obviously, he fucking made it in Photoshop in about 30 seconds, and that adds to the flavor. Like, I can, I, I wince when I see it, and it makes it, just, it's one of the best emotes on the entire platform. Like, Gmart's got some just real stinkers, and I love it. <laughs> he, he's got this thing going on. I'm seeing a lot of, like, fucking... Like, I'm looking at this other one, Gmart Zoo, and that's just a good emo. Like, that's, like, actually just a good fucking picture. Like, that's... Uh, he's got some good stuff out there. I don't have the slots. I gotta do like a fucking emote purge one of these days. I don't have enough slots to add new stuff. I've got one open one, but I haven't filled it yet. And then it's a bunch of, uh, it's a bunch of real, it's just a bunch of stuff that's gotta be killed off. Got a lot of garbage. What about animated emotes? No. I don't like animated emotes. I, the couple that exist that I've allowed to exist on BTTV are just about all I'm willing to have because um, too much motion just distracts me from being able to actually read things. Like, it, it, it's genuinely too much for me. Like, I, the most I'm willing to do is, like, weird. Anyways. Just remove an emote without telling anyone. No one will notice. Well, no, because the second you take away an emote, everyone goes, ah, I can't believe that was my favorite one. 
I love that emo. That was my favorite one. And then when I check like the fucking analytics for when the last time someone used it was, it'll be like fucking someone typed it by accident while trying to type another emote two weeks ago. And that was the last time someone used it. That was my favorite one. I like that. It, I like that it existed. That was mine. That was my favorite emote. Sleepy Rummy, thanks for the five. You give it up. Thank you very much. Tomato dead. Oh, that one's, that one's, uh, let me tell you which ones are on the fucking chopping block. That would be really easy. I wouldn't even fucking wince if they were just deleted. Garlic, slice. Tomato dead, slice. Rat, get the heck out of here. That one doesn't need to exist anymore. Get that one the heck out of here too. Um, I mean, it's hard because I've got a lot of really fucking good emotes. My artists have all done very good jobs. So obviously like stuff like Bean is gonna get deleted if I needed to make space, obviously. Cause that's not even mine. I stole that. Old or who could be deleted. One or the other could be destroyed. And I think it would be old. Cause I think who, it, it, when you're down to the smallest resolution, old could probably just be taken away. Cause I think enough people, I don't think there's enough reason to hold an entire spot for two almost exact copies. So old would probably be removed before who gets removed because who can be used for old. I remember hot butter. <laughs> no one fucking remembers hot butter. Zev, thanks for the 25 50 subs. Thank you very much. Thank you. What about pug bit? No. I'm not gonna get rid of pug bit. Actually, I don't even have Pugbit. There's no Pug... Is, there, there is a Pug emote. Yeah. I'm not gonna get rid of Pugbit. That's a newer one. And it's a good emote. Newer stuff I'm not gonna get rid of because it's actually... It's, like, good. And it's not, like, aged. It hasn't aged, like, fucking milk. Probably get rid of Tomato D. That one I'd probably get rid of. I don't think that one needs to exist. I don't think people use it that much. Besides, D colon's funnier. Like, actual flat out D colon is better. Right? I don't want emotes that, and like, this is sort of the way I see it. If I'm making, like, if I'm getting more emotes made. I don't want emo. I'd rather have an emote that isn't used that much, but has a specific unique purpose than one that is simply trying to cut in line of another emote that already exists, right? So like, I, like there are certain ones that serve the same purpose as an emote that already exists, so why am I using that one? You know, they're gonna be just, they're all gonna be dead one day. They're all gonna be dead one day. So tomato lull next. Hey, idiot. I don't have a tomato lull emote. I have a tomato BWL emote, which will always fill its own fucking spot because there are no BWL emotes on Twitch. Stupid, stupid idiot. Bursting with laughter isn't a commonly used term, turns out. Bursting with ligma, parentheses laughter. Imagine how much different the world would be 
if Ligma hadn't happened, you know, if like we, if that joke hadn't happened, imagine how much more innocent everything would be in this world. But now everywhere I go, I gotta worry that I'm constantly stepping on eggshells. What if wordplay didn't exist? Yeah, what if everything was a lot more boring? We would just have chicken butt joke. Can someone tell me the chicken butt joke? Because I don't remember that one. And it better be funny. Someone tell me the chicken butt joke. Guess what? What? Wait, that's it? My smile actually went away from my face. Like that's, that was like a fucking instantaneous thing. That was actually kind of like magical. Like I read the fucking punchline cause I thought it was like something more than that. And I, I've never felt a smile wash away from my face so quickly. Yikes. Guess what, what? This one's gonna be funnier. This one, they already know that the last one didn't land. This one's gonna be funny. All right, they just did the same one again. Is this really how it is? He just keeps falling for it. Elameo! <laughs> Elameo! Elameo, dude! All right, chat. I'm out of water. Oh my God. Hey, I'm gonna stand up, grab some water, and then I'll be right back. I bet you also go to the bathroom. And then we're playing coin game. I've had enough of you. I've had enough. I will be back in a moment. I'm back. Jerry, what the fuck are you doing here still, Jerry? You think I didn't see you? Think I didn't see that? Insubordination, huh? In 2021, the last day of 2021? Jerry? He was cursing. Jerry, was he was cursing mods? He was cussing? While I was gone. They came in here and started cussing. <laughs> Why? 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 You're lucky I'm starting to crash from a lack of caffeine or I would totally fucking break you in half right now. You're lucky that I, my, my power and my ability to like slap back and take people down in Twitch chat is completely reliant on how much caffeine I have on me and I'm running out. You're lucky I'm dying. Snap you in half like a disc. Laugh it up. 
Laugh it up. Laugh it up, dude. When was that clip made? When, what year was that? All right, because I've been pumping every day since. Every day since I've been pumping. What year was it made? Then try it again. Dude, last time I tried to... I... I... Shit you not, I tried to... Do, I was considering doing a breaking disc stream like a couple months ago. But then as I was buying the disc that I was going to like use for it, I got stopped by the police. And they said, and I quote, We can't let you do that because the force of you breaking the disc would possibly send shrapnel through the walls of your house. We'd have to evacuate the neighborhood because of the speed of the shrapnel from you breaking the disc at the incredible strength of your arms. They said that to me. They said I wasn't allowed to break the disc anymore. And I said, well, how am I supposed to prove my power then? And they laughed and said, there's no need to do that. Just look at you. And I didn't know whether to take that as a compliment or an insult, but I think it was a compliment because then one of them slapped me on the ass. So I think it was a compliment. <laughs> All right, it's time to play some coin game. Time to play some coin. We got some coin game on the docket, Chad. We got some coin game on the docket. I wonder if this game will work. They added like fucking 20,000 new video games to coin game chat. And on top of that, they added like new jobs in the survival mode. I don't know if I want to play survival mode though. Cause the thing is, uh, that mode kind of needs to get its second update to be good. I think. So maybe in 2022, survival mode. Survival, please. I'll play survival mode till I die one time. And then at that point, I'm gonna play normal mode so I can actually play the games properly. Cause you only get so much money in survival mode. I don't, I can't survive. My, my survival odds are low in the non, in like the normal survival mode. I, I, I'm not good at it. I hate the character models. Why? You see, I just, I, honestly, it is strange, but I think it would be better if both of them had the eye, like the glasses that are un, uh, you know, that aren't see-through, because this one doesn't blink. They don't have eyelids. They don't have eyelids. Which is pretty bad. They might as well have just let you play as a robot, huh? Does anyone wear their hair in pigtails IRL? I'm pretty sure people do. I mean, I don't personally. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Let me lock my mouse so that never happens again. Let me just... So, I am noticing one thing now that I'm looking at the models more. and It definitely does look like my character's clothes are painted on. So what kind of paint am I feeling like today? Ooh, yeah. All right. Why does it say coin on her ass? Look, bud, I gotta ask you this. Why are you checking out the ass of this disgusting fucking eyelidless monster in the coin game? Why is that what you're looking at? Like, I, that's what's baffling me is that my eyes have been sort of avoiding it entirely and you're like wow huh? whoa <laughs> what the heck in the heck all right let's get let's get in the game <laughs> damn dude damn <laughs> holy heck 
about my character's dumpy? Hang on, go back. Does my character got dumpy? Damn, it's like a fucking... It's like a barren expanse down there. It's like nothing. It's completely barren. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're playing survival mode. I'm deleting my old game entirely because I don't even know if it'd work. There's some new jobs. We'll check it out again. I think most of the new jobs are in Captain Willie's uh, uh, boat. I think that's the name of the brand. And there's a pizza job now and some other stuff. We need a dumpy slider. You super duper don't. Day one. Let's see what you got, kid. Ah, 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 ah. I got a text. Whoa, what's going on with my hand? Whoa, what's going on with my camera? It's, uh... Oh, hey. This is not normal. I'm just gonna go ahead and new game. Uh, let's just do this, uh, give this another reset. Uh, my neck was broken. I woke up with a broken neck. Dude, that's how I feel most days. Not a good first impression. Dude, if you're... Look, dude, if there's one thing I know about coin game, it's that it's an almost flawless game, and I love it, and no amount of minor bugs could take that away. This game is like a fucking beautiful masterpiece. I'm never, ever, ever, ever going to let anyone talk shit about coin game. <laughs> oh, there we go. All right, chat. So the trick with coin game in survival mode is um, that I have a curfew, I have to eat food, and I have to survive, and I have to do jobs, or I will die. Okay? Good news is you don't actually have to win this to um, sell everything in here for money. So I'm just gonna go ahead and open this, and uh, yeah, never, ever, ever actually, is that a gamer chair? Is that a hydraulic back on the gamer chair? Is that a fidget spinner? Usually I try to pawn everything out of my room, but it seems that my... How's my character got a knife? Why the heck in heck does my character have a, uh, a knife? It's weird. Mima, Gary. Jerry's gas and go. Nope. Auto snacks. We're not going there. What? We're not going to Jerry's! I won't go to Jerry's! Let's see, let's take an inventory of our food situation. We have some cola. We have some fish. We're low on energy. We got some, uh, vitamins. We got some, uh... What is that? Is that cheese? Is that cheesy poof? Oops. That was accidental. Is that, is that cheesy poofs? That's cheesy poofs, baby. It's cheesy poofs. Put that in my inventory. That's for food for later. Where's Mima? Mima? Damn, dude. Jerry's room is fucking really good. I keep forgetting that he's got, like, so many things... He's got, like, the... He's got everything. Like, everything. Look, that's a... That's a painting he drew. That he drew this. Fucking hate him. I hate Gary. I don't like Gary. I'm going out. I'm going out! That's not Jerry! Chat, there's like five different Gary's, Larry's, Terry's, and Barry's in this game. 
We're gonna head on out. I'm gonna try to make us some goddamn money. I'm zooming. All right. No. No, I don't think so. We're gonna swing by the pawn shop. After I've done some preliminary setup, of course, there's some things that we want to do before we go to the pawn shop. All right, everyone knows the rules. <laughs> everyone knows the knows the rules. So it begins. We just all right. I got a good amount of stuff here. <laughs> Ooh! Mine? Those glow sticks will sell. I can sell those at Barry's. Not to be confused with Jerry. Yep. <laughs> Why is this stuff in the dumpster? Where the hell's my, where the hell's the stuff I'm looking for? We're looking for fucking lottery tickets, all right? Bruh. My trash! Shut up! Nothing else in here. I can't get out. Help! Alright, let's go. Already dumpster diving five minutes in. You mean the meta? You mean already following the meta of the game? The thing, the way the game's meant to be fucking played? Five minutes in? Yeah, I am. I am following the meta. Five minutes in. We've got two dollars to our name, you understand? We need to make money. How do we make money? Dumpster dive, fuckers! Get out of my way! This game has some FPS problems when you first... Get out of the goddamn way! All right. Let's see what's in on berries today. Berries high demand items. Inflatable natural hammer. I saw light sword red. We're not gonna be able to get that cat pillow blue cow plush. Might be able to pull some of that off, but first there's some things I need to sell. Drop that. Drop that. Drop that. Drop that. Drop that. All these things are being sold to Barry. We need some cash. We need it now. We need it right now. Even the fucking empty. Like cans. Hey, baby, want you run the broom around the corners here? It's looking pretty dirty. How's it going, Barry? What's that gonna be? Five dollars. Cha-ching. Barry making that loop. You have a good day now, Barry. You fucking animal. Get the hell out of here. That's new. Motel. Islandville Motel, that's a new place. Hang on. Let me, let me take a look over there. Hello? Can I stay here without my family getting like mad at me and abducting me at night? Anything I can sell in this place? Can I break into the house? No. There's an office over here. Take a look over there for a minute. Dumpster. I'll be right back. I get what I get. It's a losing lottery ticket. It's okay, we can, we can bring that to Barry. Barry will buy that. Barry will take those, he takes those. Get back on the bike. We need easy money, we need easy money now. What do I got for food? I have energy drinks, I can drink these. My health is not a concern right now. What is, is my energy. We got one more thing. We need to make some money today. Let's, where do I get a cow plush? Do I get them from this place? Do I get them from the arcade? Here, I don't know how to jump with this bike. I try. I, I made the sound of a person trying to jump, but I did not make any input. I didn't make an input at all. 
Party people! Party people! Let's get this party started! Using my people. So it's time for the customary show everyone that I'm the best. So I'm going to go ahead and just, uh, you know, sink the classic right in front of everyone, just to remind everyone that I'm the best. So no one fucking gives me bullshit for the rest of the day. Check it. Bonus ball right away. Bonus, Bonus ball. round instantaneously. Bonus ball. Bonus ball. Bonus ball. Just so no one fucking forgets. Bonus ball. Was that another bonus ball? Yeah, look at that. One ball. And look at all that. Look at all I made in one. Still waiting for one more. Yeah, it's 133 bonus tickets, like it was nothing. And that's another one in the question mark right away. Stay in your goddamn lane. All right, check this one out. Another 351 tickets in one click. Hey, hey, you wanna see another one? Fuck, that was way too close. <laughs> Damn it! I almost had it too. You all saw. You wouldn't have believed it if I got another one in the question mark. You would have thought I was cheating. I had to fail at least once. How more balls I got? I got one more ball? All right. All right. I'll settle for 520 or so tickets on my first approach. Yeah, I'll, I'll settle for 524 total tickets. Y'all better watch yourself out there. Y'all better watch yourself out there. How's it going? You gotta... Get the fuck out of my way, alright, guy? You got a, uh, you got cows here? Hey, how's Rich Uncle Phil doing? You tell him I said thanks. No, this looks like what I want. It's the cheapest thing you sell. Hey, kid, get out of here. I'm working. Stuffed coin. How much were glow sticks going for? Like 50 cents? Like nothing? Right? Get me out of here. Look, the tickets... The tickets are universal. You can take them to other places as well. Okay. The tickets are universal. We just need games that make us a lot of money. We need games that make us a lot of money quickly. I can't believe Tomato commissioned a hacker just to make this stream. I wouldn't do that. I don't have any money. All right, chat. We're going to do two things. First, okay. Actually, and only... I'm going to go to the... Whoa, hang on. Can I... This is the most... Oh, there we go. We can zoom with it. Okay. Uh, this is new. I want to go to One-Eyed Billy's Funny Arcade with the with the uh, stuff. <laughs> with the, uh, it's an arcade. I don't know why I described it like that. I want to go to One-Eyed Billy's. So if I get to One-Eyed Billy's, we can try out some of the new games while I'm trying to make money. It'll be more interesting that way. First of all, I'm going to stop by a couple more, uh, you know, um... Dumpsters. Try to get us some food for tonight, because, you know, we're going to be struggling out there. What is this? Cool. Get, a, get that in there. This will sustain us for another night. Come on. Let's go to One-Eyed Billy's. Let's get over to Billy's and try to make some money. This house is weird. Guess that's for pizza. If I knew how to do pizza. Is this the place? Wow, I got here faster than I thought I would. This place is a lot closer than I realized. Alright. One-eyed billies. 
We should be able to make some money here. The, the, the games in this place I actually have the least practice with. But I'm not, I'm not too worried. I, uh... <laughs> I actually, uh... I used to work here. So every single game in this place... <laughs> I know all the tricks. I know all the tricks, Chad. I know every single trick. Okay. Wait, what's this? 24-hour pizza delivery. Purchase delivery pizza here for seven dollars. Uh, why? Wait, why am I? Why would I purchase the pizzas here for seven dollars? Deliver the pizza before the timer runs out and collect your payment plus. Okay, so I invest seven dollars and make more than seven dollars back if I deliver it in time. I have a fucking idea. How about I don't do that and I instead make some goddamn money at the at the pirate place? I can handle this. Skeet shoot. I've got like a really good mouse now. I'm not too concerned about that. I bet I could... Stay out of my way and this kind of thing won't happen to you. All right? Watch it. What did I just say? Big mistake. Octo swirl. No, that one sucks. I don't like octo swirl. Pirate plunder. Is that... Oh, is that just pachinko? You know, that's two hundred. That's two dollars per play. I'm not some kind of pussy. Get ready to plunder. Ninety dollars. Ninety ticket. That's not actually for two dollars. That's um very bad. Do I get multiple? Don't. 120, that's also not bad. That's not bad. That's not bad, I get another still. This one's going all the way to 1,000. That was 250 tickets. That's not bad. I mean, I'm not planning on playing it again. God, no. But uh, it's not bad. That one's pi pile. Wait, hang on, this one's also new. Why am I spending, I, I, will, I have to live off of this money. What is it? Oh, baby. Hold up. Yo, this one's my shit. This one's my shit. Staking blocks. Bro. Bro. I'm a grade A stacker. Who's Jerry? Don't worry about it. Stop distracting me. You're distracting me. I'm, I'm going to fail my stacking like this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy, easy. Everyone just stay calm. Everything's going to be fine. Why was the next prize seven? I got distracted because the next prize was 1,700 tickets. Which kind of freaked me out. I, I, I got like actually startled because I was like, I'm winning. And then I immediately wobbled. We're almost out of money. Yo, hold up. Is this lava mayhem? I am not gonna have any money after this. This is all my money. You can load more than. This is the game that's made to ruin my life. I shouldn't be doing this. Okay. Have I made money yet? What have I done? This is all my money I put in this one. I, this one's too much. This one's way too much. How many more balls do I have? Oh, I got loads of balls. We got loads of balls. We just gotta get these two sections lit up. No problem. We are not in a million fucking years gonna pull this off. We lost all of our money today. We, what am I gonna tell Jerry? Not to be confused with Jerry, or Gary, or Barry. What am I? Have I made money yet? Oh my god, but I'm so close. If I just get one into that corner. Please. 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 I feel like I haven't made any money.
fuck are you looking at? Bruh. All right, chat, it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Let's count our tickets. Wait, we can just play this game. Yeah. <laughs> they won't let me. I'm on survival mode. I can't do that. Look, we've got 10,000 tickets. We can make some money. We can, we can fucking, we'll buy a, we'll buy something and pawn it at Barry's for cash. Hey there, Swap. What's up? What you want to trade for? I would like to trade. I would like a shell plush toy. Oh, good choice, matey. Thanks. Had one just like that back in captain school. I'm gonna sell this at Barry's for five dollars, which will allow me to continue to get the fuck out of my way. It'll allow me to continue to survive for even a couple more moments, Chet. We're gonna be fine, all right? We're gonna be fine. If anything, I'll just go babysit for a day, whatever. Get out of my way! Watch it! Where am I? I'm okay. I'm fine. Everything's fine. I'm gonna do some- I've heard that there's like treasure now in like the- like the wilds of the map. So I'm kind of tempted to do a little bit of off-roading as well and like try to see if I can find any boxes because if I found some boxes I would have some money. If I made some money I'd be able to uh, buy more games. And like have fun. Look at that. Campsite. Go over there, steal anything they have, steal all their food. Campsite. We're just gonna steal all their food. <laughs> Sorry about this, assholes, but it's you and me. And it might as well be you. Give me this. Anything in there? <sighs> we taking this. Why would I... My character is, uh, looks like a monster in this thing. We're gonna go ahead and not sit in that ever again. Anything I can steal? Is that a fire? Wait, I see something. I see something. Everyone shut up, I see something. What is this? Treasure. Oh my god! Oh no. The cow plush. And more importantly, a b b b b b b b b b boatloads of cash scratch card. What's one game? Scratch card. If we win anything, we make money? We didn't spend any money on this, baby! That's twelve dollars! I'm out of inventory space, I can't give her some. I don't need you. I'm gonna pawn off this cow for cash. We're gonna take it to berries. And then I gotta go to the doctor, I'm dying. I'm dying, I've been living a life of... I've been living a life of luxury. I haven't taken, I've been eating garbage, complete trash. Believe it. My character drives like a. Oh. Scratch <laughs> card. Yes. It's a heckin' heck, am I? Step by berries. Yes. Mm. 
Give me that. I'll be taking this. That'll sustain me for another winter. What else we got here? What's this? Worthless. What else we got here? What's this? Garbage. What else we got here? Garbage. Got box. Don't eat it. Box. Don't eat it. Box. Don't eat it. What's this? I saw something. Box. Back. Don't eat it. Nothing in there worth my time. I'm out of here. No one tell Jerry I was here. Let's ride. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling Jerry you wouldn't dare. All right, everyone, be cool. We all know that cows are in. We're going to make a lot of money off of this. Hey, Barry here. If you need any help out What's up, Barry? I'll be back here counting my bread. I got something for you, something you're going to like. Oh, yeah. $10. Yeah, that'll do. I just want to also sell these glow sticks because they're just taking up space. I don't need this either. This is just ammo. All this is going in. We'll make like $12. And then I'll be able to feed myself tonight. Hey, baby, there's no smoking in the Lambo. Why is it not letting me press the button? Uh, Barry? It's not letting me... Maybe you can't recycle this? Hello? Barry, give me the item back. Barry? Barry, you can't do this! It'll take the glow sticks. Does he know this was... Oh, he'll take them one at a time. I don't know why he wouldn't take them all together. Maybe with these glow sticks, he's bad. I'm keeping the shell, Chet. You don't need to tell me what to fucking do. All right, I'm keeping the shell. I'm gonna fucking sell it later when maybe it's actually valuable. He killed the cow. I didn't even... I didn't... I'm not gonna lose a wink of sleep over the cow. I need money. I need money. Was it this? No, I can. I don't know why it wouldn't let me sell everything in a pile. It's weird. All right. That's some money. Hey, Barry. Barry, I see how much money you got back there, Barry. Why don't you let me get some of that, Barry? Barry! Let's just get back out there. Now that we got money, chat, we're gonna swing by the convenience store and buy some real food. Some things to sustain ourselves for now. All right. We gotta make some money. But we need food to survive long enough to make the money. Let's get in there. Hey. I would like some food and various things. I don't, there's already swan goose food at the house. We don't need to buy anything more for that bastard Gary. He makes enough money on his own. Gary doesn't. So that's one thing. I want some more food for myself. Three dollars. Gary makes plenty, he's gonna be fine. Buy some food for me so I can live. The goldfish can't take care of themselves, so that'll go in there as well. They have to be fed by me. Some medical supplies in case I get stabbed. It's a cruel, crazy world out there. And um, last but not least, uh, I want to play pinball. God, I don't know. No, don't play pinball. Uh, a mystery box. If you'd be so kind. And that'll be all. Thank you. 
Why? What is your problem today? Thanks, jackass. What was that about? Employee of the month, huh, Skippy Goodman? It's even your name. Gooey Bears Jawbreakers Jelly Bits. I thought maybe you could play like one of those things where you like spin the thing and then you get like a funny prize and it could be really rare. That'd be kind of nice. I wouldn't mind getting a uh, box. Chat the box. I don't know how to tell you this, but the box isn't an actual item, which is why it didn't get moved into the bag. Guys, yeah, your nitwit is showing again. Y your inner nitwit is showing again. I don't know what to tell you. The box was never, it was a bit, it, well, it's not real. I was looking around to see if there was any, like, any children that may have, like, dropped items I could steal and pawn. <laughs> I've dropped that far. I, I, I've fallen that far. I'd be willing to, like, sweep in if, like, a child dropped, like, an inflatable toy. I just grab it and sell it. Well, no questions asked. I would. We're gonna stop by. All right, it's not late. It's not late, but I am gonna stop by the house. I don't want to be out too late tonight. Mima. I just want to stash some things and make sure that I am like, you know, gonna be okay. Oh God, listen to who it is. Oops. He's, he's noted that we're home. We're gonna put all this in the freezer. Okay. Fish flakes and first aid, which we're gonna keep on us. I want the first aid on us, so if I get got, I won't fucking die. These cans of dew will go in the fridge. No problem. That closed up. How's Gary doing on food? He's fine? He may never not be fine. He's gonna be good for a while. How fish doing? 91? Okay, everyone's doing good. You've had enough of that for tonight. Yeah. That's what I thought. Why don't you go to sleep? Yeah? That was the animation of a, like, dying animal from Unity. Like, that was not a sleeping animation. That was a, you just, like, in the hunting game, you just shot the goose and it falls over dead in Unity. Like, that is it. That is a death animation. All right, chat. This is where we're going to store all of our special items that we eventually may sell. But for now, we'll just kind of, like, use to hone our talent, our skill. Check it. Check this one out. I'm one of the best. All right? And it shows. Look at that! This is the difference between me and you! I got it. I'm going to sleep. Wait, is it too early for me? I think I might die. I need to, like, eat eat a snack. I'm gonna, like, get a- I'm gonna get a pizza- I'm gonna get a za on the oven. Or maybe, like, a- Yeah, I'm gonna eat this- I thought you were going to sleep. <laughs> Ugh. What? This is how you cook them. Yeah. Why don't you go to sleep already? Alright, it's past your bedtime. Go on now. And my food is just about done. Dude. I've had Salisbury steak before, with green things. I, I like it. I, it's okay. Eat that. Eat that food. Eat this. Oh yeah. Do I have vitamins in the house? Can I, like, sustain myself? 
There we go. Because my health, I, I was, when I entered this world, I was half dead already. Which is strange, to be honest. Like, I entered this world mostly dead. Which is really weird. Alright. I'm feeling good. I think I'm, uh, I might turn in for, maybe we do a little bit of, like, outside exploring for treasure chests. Maybe that's what we do with our extra time. Because I don't really want to... I don't really want to do the whole arcade thing tonight. It's I just took fucking fall damage jumping off of a rock. I'm having a bad time. Might just like do a little bit of a scouring around the perimeter to see if maybe like Jerry or Gary or Barry or Terry or Larry or you know any of the rest of them may have buried treasure around. To get some extra cash. That guy's drifting. Just, you know, check the... Check the perimeter of the property. Nothing. It's a ghost town out there. Ow! Ow! Is this possibly a Truman Show scenario? What would make you think that? What are you, like a freak? You know, it's not always about you. Or about me. Okay? Like, imagine thinking that you're in a Truman Show scenario is awfully egotistical to believe that it's all about you all the time. That someone, that your life is interesting enough to be like a, sh a show. It's pretty bold, man. Pretty bold. Not seeing anything out here. It's not about me? No, Poro, shut up! It's never gonna be about you. Ever. Never! What's the blue bar? That's my- that's how much time I have left before my Mima comes and picks me up. If I'm not home yet. I'm sad now. You're always sad! It's, it's like an attention thing. Like, they're always sad. It's pathetic. I'm feeling bad for it. I'm feeling bad. I'm going to sleep, and when I wake up, I'm going to make a million dollars tomorrow, all right? I got nine dollars, I'm going to double it, or I won't come home. All right, that's my promise to everyone. Also, how do I go to sleep? I do not remember how to sleep in my own bed in this video game. I can sit down in the chair. It might not be late enough for me to sleep yet. I don't think it's late enough for me to sleep yet. I think my character is still wired. All right, we can get in a little more practice with the old claw. Check it. Fucking perfect execution again. See, the only reason I don't bring this in is if it's a like actual uh, size and weight problem. It's too heavy. It's too heavy, this thing. It's too heavy. It's not that I can't do it. It's that it's simply the size of it. It's not made for this. See, look at that. It's too wide. Not getting enough grip on it. It's physically impossible. It's not a me problem. I didn't, even, I didn't even want to do that. Can I not go to sleep? It seems like, yeah, it's too early. I guess going to sleep at, uh, at a smooth 6 p.m. is a little too early for my guy. All right. What do you want? Right now, Mima, I'm going out. I'm going out for a late night drive. I'm gonna look for treasure. Out by One-Eyed Willies. If I don't come back, it's because I left forever. I may never come back, depending on what I find out there on the open road. Can I, like, babysit here? Hang on, I swear I could, like, babysit at one of these houses for cash. Wait, what's that? I saw something! Hey! What's up? Dog? Let me in. Let me in, I wanna hang out. Dog. Puppy. Hey. 
That's a good dog. That's a good dog. Can I steal this? <laughs> this is your ball? Get that. Yeah! Yeah, dude, yeah! We'll do a mow in the lawn. How about you clear out? Do a late night mowing, make us some money. Crab dog put into inventory. Yeah, it is kind of psycho, some of the things you can do in this video game. I don't know if I'm gonna have time to do this all before the um, sun sets and Mima shows up and uh, picks me up and takes me home against my will. This is a lot of lawn. I got four minutes. I'm guessing backyard is also included. It's getting fucking dark. <laughs> Nothing like night mowing while the dog barks at you. There's simply no way I do this all before Mima shows up and rips me uh, into the sky. I'm gonna die. Chad, it's uh, not looking good. Um, a lot of lawn to mow here. Actually, I think I can do it. I can pull it off. I absolutely can. It's gonna take some work, it's gonna take some doing, but I can do it. Okay, I can. Just gotta get this last patch over here, we can do this. Mowing the lawn without consent? I don't know if you can see up here, but it says I have a job to do, and that means I have consent to do it. I didn't break onto this person's... Look, you don't leave a mower out on your lawn if you don't want it to be mowed by someone for money. Okay, that's like the law. Put the mower in the garage then. If I see a mo like a lawnmower out on a lawn, and the lawn is unmowed, I'm gonna mow the fucking lawn. I'm gonna get some goddamn money. I'm gonna call the police. One or the other. We know the law. Oh yeah, look at this lawn getting mowed. This is how, what I would describe as a perfect mowing experience right now. And the dog has yet to cause any more ruckus. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We're gonna get this done in time. We're gonna finish. We're absolutely gonna get this done. It's gonna make us a million dollars. And we're going to One-Eyed Willie tomorrow. We're gonna make a billion dollars. Mowing license? You don't need a license to mow. I don't think. I, mean, I think there's like a minimum age where people are like, you shouldn't be doing this. But I'm pretty sure I'm fine on that. My character is very clearly a grown man. So I think I'm good. We should be fine. So basic mowing. It's just grass. Would you change any part of your life if you found out that grass felt immense agony whenever you stepped on it? Or would it kind of just be like one of those things where you go, it's not my problem. Next time, don't be grass. Is that, would you, would you feel bad if like scientists came in and they're like, yo, all plants are in constant agony when you touch them. If you even touch a plant, it's basically screaming. It goes, Aah! the second you touch it every time. What do you do? Do you change anything? I've already come this far. Damn, chat, you guys are fucking cold as ice. Now, okay, second point. Well, you found out the plant was violently climaxing every single time you touched it. Would that make you want to stop? <laughs> would, that, would that change your fucking mind? If you found out the plants were uh, really into it? How violent? Violent. Like the scientists considered not publishing the discovery. 
levels, okay? <laughs> they considered keeping it quiet. Nature is fucking disgusting. All right? And there's so much we don't understand. True. Oh yeah, that's a that's a mode lawn right there, chat. That's that's a mode lawn. We're going to finish it in time. There's no way we don't. I'm going to black out. Everybody get away from me, dog. Don't touch this. Oh, I'm alive. Hey, fetch. <laughs> You're a good boy. What? You're a good lad, but I gotta keep you off the lawn. Stay here. All right, that's fine. Just stay out of the way. I don't want you to get hurt. I don't want you to get chewed up by the fucking blades. I'm running out of time. I got two minutes thirty to get this thing done. Well, it's not really two minutes thirty. It's more like four minutes. And all we have is that last part over there. And probably a missed spot or two. Oh yeah, this part's gonna take a minute. This might be the most difficult part of the entire lawn. Nah, we got it. We totally got it. Yeah, we got this. I'm gonna get rid of the tree now. So I don't have to worry about it. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, we got this in the bag. No problem. No problem! Yeah! See, I'm always afraid when I was mowing lawns as a kid that a squirrel would run into the lawnmower. You got- you get some psycho animals on the east coast. I was always fucking terrified when I would mow the lawn that like a fucking chipmunk or something would like dive into the lawnmower after like an acorn. And I would get fucking sprayed by like, just like, squirrel guts and viscera. Rabbits, all of them. Every animal out here on the East Coast is 100% willing to charge at you for something that's beneath your feet. And I was always afraid that I would be like pushing a lawnmower down, like a down like a path or something, and a squirrel would go, "Oh fuck, that's mine!" They'd see like a like an acorn go under it, and they just just get like ripped up. They have anyone ever? It's a genuine thing. I'm not trying to be like making things up. Like it happened. It didn't happen to me, but I know it happened. It always terrified me. I ran over a man once. <laughs> yeah, well, who hasn't? It's too many vagrants on my lawns. All the lawns in this world. I was always afraid. Of, I was afraid. The one I was really afraid of was moles. Cause like, I don't like moles, but I also don't want a mole to poke its head out of the dirt cause it's feeling like a rumbling above it. Pokes its head out and its head is just fucking destroyed. I, I, that terrified me when I was younger. Am I done? Oh no, I'm missing one piece of land. There's a small remaining patch of grass that has yet to be mowed. Oh, I see it, corner. Oh, yeah, fifty dollars! Let's get the fuck home, baby! Tomorrow, we're gonna go out and buy Deathloop, baby. We make one more dollar, we can buy Deathloop, baby. Best game of the year, baby. 2021 best game of the year, Deathloop. We can buy Deathloop. Fuck yeah. Go buy Deathloop! It's a time traveling looping game. You know it's got tons of content, dude. It has to. Goodbye, Death Whoop. 
Let's get home. Bro, fucking love gaming. Everyone's game of the year. It's my game of the year. And I haven't played it yet. I love gaming. What's up, Gary? You know who doesn't have $59? You, you little idiot. <laughs> <laughs> what? Actually, cannot believe you just said that to me. Wait, are these good for me? Oh, the green ones are good for me. These ones are not, the red ones are not as good for me. Noted. Well, me, ma, I'm going to sleep. Night night. Tomorrow, we're going to One-Eyed Willie's and we're going to make a million billion dollars. All right? Wait. Oh, uh, the blue hadn't filled up yet. I was like, wait a minute. Why am I still about to get like picked up by grandma? All right, let's go. To Willie's. We're gonna hear every single employee there groan and roll their eyes as I storm in at 7 a.m. I'll be the first person there. I'm gonna storm in at 7 a.m. and book it towards like the one game machine at that place that I know I can always win at and just fucking really piss everyone off. Put, I'll shove people out of the way. I'll get on like the funny dropping ball one. Let's look out for uh, boxes while we're here. There had to always be that one shithead kid at the arcade that would always show up and, like, just play one game specifically to win all the tickets and then get, like, the thing because he knew the exact way to cheese it. That happened, right? Surely. Just like it happens in this video game. It had to happen. Some shithead kid that would just show up and be like, Haha! I'm really good at clicking this button! Not even a kid, but a fully grown man. I walk in, 25 years of age. I, everyone rolls their eyes. I stumble over to pile. What's one game of pile? Just one game of pile. There's a 2,000 ticket bonus if I win, baby. 2,000 tickets, baby. All I gotta do is win, baby. All I gotta do is win it, baby. Whoa, actually that works. That's perfect. Just gotta win it, baby. You had multiple tries? I didn't know I got multiple tries. I thought I lost. I thought I lost the second I missed one. I get multiple. You tell me I got multiple tries? Yo, this one's easy. Hang on, put it back in. I'm not done. I didn't hear no bell. I didn't hear no bell. This game needs to go faster. This game's taking it too easy on me. Let's treat me like a child. This game's treat me like a child. Let's speed, let's speed this up. Alright, let's speed this up a little bit. Let's speed this one up. Come on. Am I an infant to you? Speed it up. Yeah. <laughs> Next stop, 2100 tickets. <laughs> oh, I'm doing it again by accident. I meant to say no, I wanted to leave. Oh, that's fucked. I fucked it up. There's simply no way in a million years, I'm winning this one. We might as well just give this one up. The money's gone. My hopes and dreams are gone. This one's pretty much done. 
You know what the problem is? It's the force of the block. They throw these blocks down like they're trying to kill someone. How am I supposed to do anything like this? Look at the force of the block. Don't move. It's that easy, dude. It's so fucking easy. It's pathetic how easy that game was. That was actually easy as fuck. That was actually easy as fuck. And that's how you make a billion trillion dollars. Step off! <laughs> Trying to copy my techniques, kid? Trying to copy my techniques, you piece of shit? Trying to copy my techniques, that's funny. You're funny, you're a funny kid. You know what you don't look like? You're, you're a robot, don't look waterproof. You're a robot, don't look waterproof. <laughs> What is this? I waited two dollars to play boats? I don't wanna play boats. I'm sorry. What game is this? Was this one made for me? Is this Mega Drop Extreme Edition? This one's new. Yo, we got Mega Drop 2, baby. <laughs> Let's get a drop. Ten? You know, you gotta lose some to win some. You gotta lose some to win some. You gotta lose some to win some. What is that one gonna be? Is that gonna be question mark right away? Is that gonna be bonus? 30? I'll take a 30. We're warming up! Alright, it's only a dollar to play this one. Drop another. That's a sink straight into 10. That's not great. Again. Whoa, what the heck and heck just happened there? Whatever, 40. That guy's cheating. That guy's cheating. Someone stop that guy. That guy over there is cheating. I saw that. I'm gonna do this one right. Watch this. Where's the jackpot? There it is. Fuck, I was inches from it. I was fucking inches from it. I can do this. This is not that bad. I'm going for the middle. Eventually we'll get lucky and it'll bounce that way because I've been doing it. I've been timing it right. It's just that eventually it'll do the correct angle. You'll all see. I'm not crazy. Watch it. Damn it! I almost got the jackpot. I almost had it. How's your 2022 going so far? It's not 2022 for me. It may. It may never be. Depending on how this stream goes, I might just explode. We don't know. Give me that bonus! Simple as that. Come on. Trillion billion dollars, give it to me. 379 tickets is nothing to me. Give me another one. Do something. Got another bonus. This is the only game I ever need to play. Ever. I pay I pay $60 USD to be able to play this game. Ball game is the best one. Sorry. Sorry, dude. I don't know what to tell you. I fishy 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 fish. It's nothing on ball drop. Extra Damn dude, that could have killed someone. Well, instead we got 40 tickets, baby. Is this streamer life simulator? This is my streamer life. This is the streamer life I wish I had. Look, chat. If you could get an entire arcade rented out for a stream, that stream would be the biggest fucking stream of, like, forever. Uh 
Maybe one day. Maybe one day I'll live near an arcade and I can do that. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme give just a trillion dollars. Come on. 458 tickets. Uh, 30 tickets. I don't know why. I didn't know I could swish it that easily. I'm getting a lot of tickets out of this, actually. I'm climbing the leaderboards. I'm in the top... That's a t typical for the top 300 stream. It'll also be in the top 300 for um, Mega Drop Extreme. Uh, no one's really that surprised, are they? And my pile of tickets continues to grow. It's not surprising. All right? It's just not. I just gotta get the super jackpot, but I'll take bonus. I'll take it. I'll take anything. I'll take anything like forty or above, easy. It's time. I've grown weary of not having jackpot. Okay, I don't think I'm getting it on this one, but next time, next time, it's happening. Damn it! I thought it was really gonna happen. I really did. I really did believe. I really did. I did. I did. But that's because it's gonna happen this time, baby. Damn it! I'm getting better. You're seeing. You're seeing it happen. You're seeing I'm getting more consistent. I almost sunk it into the jackpot in one, dude. You saw that. You saw that. You saw that. Any day now. Yeah, I guess it's about that time. Well, we'll bonus just get it on the ball. bonus round. It's fine. Bonus ball. Bonus ball. Bonus ball. Bonus ball. Bonus ball. We'll get it on the bonus ball. That's not looking like it's happening. Bonus ball. Did I just get a ball robbed from me? What happened there? I was promised an extra ball, and then it disappeared right before my very fucking eyes. Give me 700 tickets. I'll take 400. Now give me the mega jackpot. Where are you going? Where are you going? Yeah, that's what I thought! That's what I thought! Now give me the normal jackpot. Okay, I'll take 30. He did it? Of course I fucking did it. Of course I fucking did it. Hey, chat. I just climbed the ranks to 155. All right. Getting close to the top 100, baby. Get the hell out of here. I've grown bored of ball drop. I've grown bored of such childish games. Newson02, thanks for the fucking 10 gifted subs. I kind of want to play... I'm a litter, for one. And I'm going to play... Uh, what's this one? Cash Claw. Yeah, I'll play Cash Claw. Cash Claw causes some FPS drop, but let's see if I can grab anything with the Cash Claw. Is that just a wad of fives over there? Just Claw right there. Well, the Claw fucking sucks. It's not a good Claw. Uh, um, uh, um, uh, um, 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 uh, um, um, the thing is, I, I see something in the Claw. Hello? Hello? Sir? Someone? Uh, there's something in the claw! 
Yeah, I'd like to play again. Damn it, why did I do I could have jostled it over the thing. I want that. I believe Cash Claw may be the worst game here. But I gotta win a little something from everything. Going in for one more dive on the claw. Oh yeah. Cash Claw is an actual scam. This is a $2 to play game. And that claw has no vertical claw. It's like, oh, here we go though, this one. This one, I've had practice with this, remember? I told you these things have a special weight to them. You got practice. What is going on with these claws today? <laughs> Seems to be a, uh, a, a wind gust perfectly situated inside Fishy Fishy. Um, thanks, Game Shorts, for the five gifted subs. The, seems to be the claws wiggling. Something fierce. Not um really sure how that's gonna impact gameplay. The answer is bad. I'm just gonna get away from that. No. Hey. Stupid looking thing. Dead body. Stupid looking guy. Look at this idiot. <laughs> <laughs> look at it, look at this idiot, dude. What's up, Shorty? Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna deposit all my prizes, but only after I collect a little bit more. Get out of my way. Uh, would you mind? Uh, after I get a little more money off of the uh, pachinko machine, I I think I could get. I think I. I think I can absolutely get the jackpot on this thing. It's not that hard. I think I can absolutely get the jackpot on this one. And by it's not that hard, I think I mean this might be the hardest one in the entire fucking video game to get a reliable jackpot on. But I'm gonna go for it. I'm not afraid of nothing. And I've already made a billion trillion tickets. I'll be able to sustain myself for years. Again. To plunder. Okay, that one was... F that's only 40 tickets. We can do better than that. Okay, that's another uh, 40 tickets. Uh, we can do better than that. We're going to do it one more time. Okay, that's another 40... Uh, that's 120 tickets uh, is all we made. I landed in the same one three times. That's like when you take a child, like a small child, to an arcade. And you give them like you 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 know they're gonna suck at the game and not win anything anyways. But they just have zero strategic skill and they just do the fucking worst thing possible and waste all of your money as you just watch quarters disappear in front of you as the kids like just like acting like a complete buffoon out there, not ta not actually no patience, no actual like awareness of how much money they're losing. I don't understand. It's not a game out there, you know. Is the problem they don't get it? For two dollars a game, kid, you're gonna fucking smash the drop button? You're not even gonna- you don't even seem like you understand what's happening to you! For two dollars a game, you're just gonna hit the drop button? I step aside! I shove the child out of the way. I'm gonna show you how it's done with stack it! With pile! I'm gonna show you how you pile. Alright, I'm, I'm the- I'm the reigning pile champ. Alright, I'll show you how it happens. I'll show you how the champ does it. Okay. I'll show you how it happens. Perfect. The last couple are all RNG. I'll tell you that right now. The last like two or three you need to spawn directly above you. No matter what, because you can't move this thing anymore really. Me? Not you. It would never be you. You don't have what it takes. Well, well, well. Love and mayhem. It's been some time. Put $10 in the machine. 
I will have what is owed to me. I will have what is owed to me. One way or another. It's two. I'll wait till it's out. I'll wait till the tray's out. And three. Fifty-five tickets? I'm doing all this for fifty-five tickets a pop? It's fine. It's gonna get better than that, I promise. Besides, it's not hard to get these spins. See, that's already two again. It's actually really easy to get these spins to happen. And we've got so many credits to make it happen, you know what I mean? There it is. There's another spin, give it to me! Is that five tickets? Five tickets. Five on that one. That's five. Should I spend ten dollars on this game? That blue ball's getting pretty close to the edge, though. Well, I wonder what I get when I when that happens. Okay, that's two. Almost got enough for another spin. Dude, we gotta be making some money off of this. There we go, another spin. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Big money. A hundred tickets. All right. Which already got me another spin almost right there. Hang on, yo, this game kind of slaps. Hold up. Yo, hold up, ball game kind of kicks fucking ass. Everyone, this might be my game. This might be my game. I know I've said that a lot about a lot of games. This one might be mine. I think I can make Meemaw proud with a game like this. Damn it. What the hell? Ball? That's bullshit. I should have had that. I just want the, I want the blue ball to fall down. I want to get this fucking corner. But for some reason, I'm not. Nothing's going over there. There we go, that should get it. There we go. Let's get another spin. Oh. Shaking with fury. Shaking with fury, not sure what to do. It's shaking. Come on. All right, let's get the corner. What's that blue ball gonna go down? That should've gone down by now. Unbelievable. Come on, that's another spin. Let's actually get a goddamn prize on this one. 30 tickets. I don't even know how many I've earned. It feels like I'm not really making much uh, money off of this. You know what I mean? Like, it's a bunch of, um, oh. How much lot? I gotta get that blue ball down. We're getting that ball down. 500 tickets! That's 500 tickets! That's actually not that. I've spent 10, no, $20 or something on this game. That's not as many as you'd like, really. I gotta get a prize out of this thing. It's not worth it. Is that another 10 fucking tickets? 10? Well, we got another two spin tokens and one. That's not bad. We're about to get another. Right? Right? <gasps> Damn it. Wait, it's still, it might, it might still happen. That, that ball's getting smushed. I don't know what's going on with it. I'm not getting like any, I'm not getting any balls over there. No, no, I can't be running out. No! No! How much did I make? I better have made like 10 billion tickets. Wait, I made 2,000 tickets? Wait, what? <laughs> How much are these balls worth? Step off. 
How many more? I, I need food. I'm dying. I got time to play one more game. We're so close to getting that last spin. Well, I got time to play another five dollars worth of game. That's only a hundred. I got time. There we go. Another spin. Give me a prize. Give me a real prize. Five hundred fucking tickets. Sometimes it, it do be as simple as that. Am I gonna get another two spins? Oh my god. <gasps> ice ball! That's the ice ball. Where's that get dumped off? It's a, a million miles away. That's not happening anytime soon. But hey, getting the middle is easy. I can definitely get another spin right now on this side. Fuck yeah, another huge spin. Another ice ball! You gotta be kidding me, you got two ice balls on the board! Two ice balls on the board right now! Some people dream of getting these many ice balls on the board. Just imagine how much money we're making off of this right now. There's another spin coming up right now. Look at this. Another spin! What's that? Lava mayhem! Five spins times three! Everything on the board multiplied by three, baby! Ice ball! Two ice, and that's another two spins! Ten, t ten tickets. <clears throat> that's okay, we got, we got more coming up. We got more, we're not gonna just get all the dinky ones. We're gonna get something good out of this. It's okay, we're gonna get something spicy out of this one. 45? That's another one. Hey, that's huge. That's good. You can work with that. Now, give me something actually. Okay. Didn't really make as much money as I would have liked out of it, but it could have been worse. We've still got more spins. We've still got another. I thought I got it again. So, son of a bitch. I just wanted those two ice balls. I'm gonna die soon. <laughs> you never want to think that when you're at an arcade. That's like, honestly, that's not an emotion you want to feel. Is uh, ever really thinking, I'm going to die soon while at an arcade. I gotta go. I'm gonna die. <laughs> I need to leave. Another $150. Just imagine how much money I've made off of this though. I was so close to getting those out of here. Go! How? I can't leave yet. I'm gonna buy some food here so I don't die. And then I'll be back. Don't even t bother trying to touch this, okay? I will flip. Can I just buy a pizza? Y'all got pizza? Hey there. What can I do for you? Yeah, I want pizza. I want pizza, pirate pizza pie. I want pizza, dude, so bad. But I've been eating, I've had way too much pizza. This, that cheese isn't melted, sir. This is, uh. Well, it'll sustain me long enough to complete my dark work. Back to the lava mayhem. Three dollars! Lava mayhem! Finish the fucking fight! God damn it! Why? Did I just get like scammed out of that? What the hell? Ice ball! That's an ice ball, baby! That's an ice ball, baby! Last spin? Come on, give me some good. Another 150. Check this out. About to get a whole additional spin. Okay, never mind. It was close. We're about to get another spin right now. Yeah, there it is. There it is. Spin time. 
I mean, we're definitely gonna get the other ice ball before this finishes, right? We're gonna get another ice ball. There it is, ice ball. And one more spin for the road. It's as simple as that, baby. It's as simple as that, baby. It's as simple as that. Is that ball still active? Is that the only reason I'm still... Okay. That was 3,000 tickets. Wait, how the fuck are there so many people with global rankings on this one? I was like, there's no way I'm not, like, one of the best in the world. There's a lot of people on the global rankings for this game. Whatever, we've got a we got a trillion tickets right now. Oh my god. 15,000 tickets. Oh yeah. Hey there, Swap. What you want to trade for? None of your goddamn business. I don't buy anything until I know what's being bought by Barry. At the pawn shop. Y'all want to see my accuracy on the range before we leave? Y'all want to see my accuracy? Check this out. Bada bing. Bada bam. Pop. 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 Bada bing. That was. That one was just. So weirdly elusive, I'm not really sure why. You baffled yet? You baffled? Okay, the ending was a little bit sloppy. Reported! Aimbot! Did I win? How many tickets did that just win me? Nine hundred and twenty. Yeah, I got like a I got a new mouse, and you wanna know what it is? It's got a button on it. Uh on the thumb that activates an aimbot. <laughs> no, I got a, it's uh there's a button on it that when you hold it, uh immediately drops the sensitivity to the lowest the mouse can do. Which is actually pretty smart. It's got like a low sensitivity, like thumb button. So like I, I, I can like really quickly switch my sensitivity. It's like a Logitech mouse. I don't know, I bought it cause I had like decent reviews. I was like, hell yeah, dude, I can use this to cheat. It made me look like a fucking guide. I gotta get out of here, my bike is stuck. Everybody got the G502. I don't know what version mine is. Yeah, mine says G502 Lightspeed, but I'll tell you one thing. All mice suck. Except for the Phoenix Nasita, which is no longer made. If that's even the mice that I'm thinking of. There used to be a really good brand of mice makers. They made some really good ones and they closed. Those are the only good mice. Ever since, every mice has sucked. Every single one. It's a Phoenix something, but that brand doesn't exist anymore. They like closed. I use a wheel. I use a trackball. Yeah, I kind of use a trackball. It's the only thing that uh, you know, can can really capture my precision. I got gorilla hands. I mean, I actually here's the thing. I actually do have like gorilla hands. So like, I I physically. Need a gigantic mouse. When this mouse breaks, which it will within a week, because every mouse I own breaks within a week, I will, uh, whoa. I will, uh, probably get one of those, try out a vertical mouse. That's, like, my next plan. I'm gonna get a vertical mouse and see how I like that. Very... Baby! What's popular today? 
hoverboard pink. I don't have enough for a hoverboard. There's no way. Uh, let's see here. Prime prizes. Plasma ball. It's definitely better to get the pet moon rock. And just buy a billion pet moon rocks. We gotta go to the fucking arcade. We're gonna buy a trillion pet moon rocks. Plasma balls. Fucking funny! I almost got hit by a car because of you! Because of how fucking funny that was, I got distracted! That's how- Oh god, you're killing me. Alright, let's look for treasure while we're out. We might find something good. This is a pretty long trip. Never know when you might see like a big chest full of goods, full of treasure. Never know. You might see something worth a billion, trillion, zillion dollars. Out here. In the arcade realm. You really just never know. We're in no man's land. There could be any number of goods out here. Nothing. There's totally something in this field. I just can't see it. Because the sun's setting. There's UFO point. We're not going there to play. Alright? We ain't going there to play, so don't even bother asking. We're going there to make some money, and then pack up and leave. Is that a building on that, like, hill? That really ugly looking hill? Well, well, well. What have we here? Alien. Is that batteries? Could sell those. Someone just said a really bizarre comment. The graphics of this game look like a memory. What does that mean? What do you what does that mean? What does that mean? What is that what are you talking about? Why do you say things like that? Why would you say that? Did I stutter? No, you were typing, so you couldn't have stuttered. I'm just trying to decipher what that what that means. What does a memory look like? I don't even think I want the glow stick. I think I'm past dumpster diving. It's all yours, idiot. Oh, I almost got hit. I almost done died. I almost done died, dude. Whatever, pet rock. What was it? Purple pet rock? It was purple pet rock, right? Here we are! Hey! Pink. Wait. That doesn't have a color attached. Well, the pl I could get the plasma ball. I could do the plasma ball. There's no... I mean, I could actually do both. Let's do a plasma ball. Let's do plasma ball and... The rock. Let's just do both. We'll do two rocks. You're coming with me. How about one for the- how about one for the road? How about one for the road just so everyone remembers who the champ is? Is 
just a warm up ball. Everyone knows you gotta have a warm up. He's washed up, dude. I'm not washed up. I'm not washed up. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Play one more game. Dude, fell off, dude. Don't you fucking say that to me, you little creep. I just gotta get back home. I gotta get the berries. Before I pass unconscious. Just gotta get the berry. Berry! I remember when this was a jackpot stream. It is, chat. I had to warm up. It's This game's so hard. Just gotta get back to berry. I just gotta get back to Barry, baby. Take a shortcut. I'm gonna make a lot of money, or I pass out. Buy a snack at Barry so I don't die. Go to the convenience store. Easy peasy. And then maybe I'll take a quick little swing on down to Jerry. Say hey to him, it's been a long time. A little bit since I've seen him. Jerry, my good friend. I said, I miss the guy. I want to talk to him for a bit. Oh. I know what I said. I might. I know what I fucking said. Better watch what you say. All right. I'm gonna stop by Barry and sell my shit. Barry! Plasma ball ball's still in, Barry? Do you want plasma ball? I got plasma ball right here, plasma ball. Get that thing sold. $44, Barry, $44. Give it here, give it to me now. Yeah, there it is, in just in time before I pass unconscious. I'd like one sour treat, if you will. Hey, baby, there's no smoking in the Lambo. You might want to put that out. I also have some pet moon rocks. Five dollars each. I also have this fucking alien... One dollar, I'll keep him. This one's mine. I also have this funny looking star. For three dollars. Don't know. Oh, that's for my like phone. Goodbye, pet rocks. Goodbye. I'm going home. Did you know you can't drive in reverse on the bike? I'm gonna swing by the convenience store and buy myself some things. I'm gonna just, I'm just gonna swing by and buy a bunch of Mountain Dew. The good stuff, not the bad stuff, the good stuff. Y'all got do? No, all you got is the bad stuff. Where's the good stuff? Whatever, I need to buy medical supplies. <laughs> I'm dying! Ugh. Oh. Fine, I'll make it work. Oh. 
I'm gonna need more medical supplies. And, uh, yeah, that'll do, that'll do, that'll do, that'll do, I'll be fine. That'll do. I don't know, I, I don't know if Jerry has any food left. Ugh. Twenty-one fucking dollars! Oh my god. I'm gonna pass out now! Drink this! Take another. Alright, let's get home. Barely alive, I cling to my survival. Let's get home. Eats band-aids again. They hold my insides together. Chat? They're holding my insides together. Whoa, how the hell did I do that kind of spin? Where's my house? I see it, yes. It all makes sense now. Who sells the do? What did you just ask me? Did you just ask who sells the do? I know who sells the do. I know who sells the goddamn do. Jerry! You in there? <laughs> Three? Well, well, well. What is this? Robot milk? <laughs> What's one? Just one. Kids outside. Quit messing just, with five, five, just one, and I'm gonna go home. Grab one. I'm gonna. Call, I'm not even gonna scratch it here. Pick it up, and we're leaving. Bought one. I'm a changed man. I'm not the same man you remember. Who stole my bike? Someone tried to steal my bike. This is why we don't go to Jerry's anymore. It's full of creeps and weirdos. Come on, let's leave. Why stop at one, streamer? I don't need to listen to you. That's the difference between two of us. I'm powerful. I'm strong. I look in the mirror every day, and I choke back tears every day because I acknowledge how powerful I am, but I don't let a single tear fall from my face, and that makes me even more powerful. Every day I look in the mirror and I start tearing up, but I never cry. I never cry. Not once. No matter how sad it looks out in, in, on the other side of that mirror, I never cry because I'm powerful, because I'm strong. I mean, in 2022, I'm going to be even stronger. Okay? Now write me, Ma. You old bag. Proof. Gary? Gary? I think I have to feed Gary. It's a good thing I bought swan food. Good God, you eat a lot of food. Fish don't eat that much. I don't see the fish asking for food as much as you I you know what I think it is cuz he just got hungry again I think if I over if I put too much food in it he's just going to eat it like a fucking dog and he's just going to keep eating cuz he'll never he'll never ever ever be full He's like a wild animal who's just like ooh there's food in front of me I better eat it because I might not see this again 
fat fuck. He hasn't eaten in two days. He's definitely not true. We've only been playing the game for one day. <laughs> it's uh, It has not been that long. I'm scratching this and I'm gonna win the jackpot. Chat. I'm a changed man, okay? I'm a changed man. Why are you saying, oh no? My time's gotta teach you not to come into my room. Now look, now I gotta put you in the box again. I'm going to sleep. Good night, Gary. He loves the box. Chad, he loves the box. And plus, I don't think this game tracks his hunger in this kind of way. So if I keep him in the box, he'll never have to eat. And that means I'll never have to buy him more food. Because he'll always be in the box. You have a good day now, Gary. You have a real good day now. Oh yeah. It's so sustain. How the hell did he Um Okay. Leave the funny alien here. Nice. Here we are. Another day in the life. What the hell? Oh, that's for the, uh, the, the thing. The, the fish. So I remember to feed the fish. All right, chat, we're going back to, going back to one-eyed, Willies. That seems to be where the money is now. I've the meta of the game has shifted. And one-eyed willies is not only one of the closest high tier options, but it's also one of the most the the dang games there are just so good. One-eyed willies has some of the best game variety in the whole dang thing. It's just premium. One-eyed Will willies has a premium selection of games for all ages. For all ages. And I'm tired of acting like it doesn't. The bike is starting to piss me the hell off. Is the problem. And I need to start thinking about how I'm going to make enough money. To buy the uh, golf cart. Because the bike is starting to drive me insane. Is Willie sponsoring the stream? No, but if Willie wants to sponsor the stream. Uh, I would decline because I don't need to be given money to tell everyone how good and valuable his product is to all of us. I don't need money in my pocket to do that. I'll do that for free. Y'all think Willie stashed treasure in the back of one of these mountains? Hang on, is that literally treasure right there? No. No. Uh-uh. I really wish this bike had a reverse. Come on! There we go. Let's get check the perimeter. You never know when Willie might have like a bunch- a box full of like treasure. Just laying around. There's a lot of surface area on the property of One-Eyed Willies. And not much of it is used. Which makes me think that maybe one day I'll just see like a big chest. Alright, let's get back in there. One-Eyed Billy's Adventure and Fun Center. This one's new. I have not played this one. What is this one? Wait, no, I have played this one. This one was... 
Have I? The music is freaking me out. The music started panicking me. I started panicking. No, I started panicking. Only 15 tickets for $2, 15 tickets. Why is the music so scary? What is this? What the fuck? F tier game. Yo. No, I don't even get money for that. Why would I play it? This is, I, I think we can all agree one thing though. Wheeler Up might be the worst game in the entire fucking arcade. I think this game is the worst one. Uh, I, I, every other game in this place, I feel joy when I play it. This one... I didn't even win any money. That was, uh... I didn't even win a single ticket. Skill issue. I'll show you a fucking skill issue. I'll show you a skill issue. I'll show you a goddamn skill issue. So you go from 10 tickets to 20 tickets, so I can't like leave. Get in there! Got it. All right, so I did it perfectly this time. This time I should make a billion trillion dollars, right? I should win the big prize. And make it worth it. Give me something good. 150 tickets. 170. That better not be all I make from this whole game. What kind of sicko? What kind of absolute fucking... Weirdo is over here. Hang on. Can I, like, get my mouse over to the side? I want to see what kind of fucking sicko is in the top 100 for Wheeler Up. I want to know who the hell is... Whatever. That's the worst game in the entire arcade. I think we can all agree. And frankly, the dev should be ashamed of himself. I'm gonna play- I'm gonna play Pile. Cause this is the best game in the whole arcade. And I- I'm not even joking when I say that, this is the best one. A perfect- A perfect union of skill and luck. To make a game that constantly gets you coming back. This game constantly- it's got a little something for everyone. It's got a little something for everyone. And someone of any age will be able to have fun playing Pile. Unless they're like a idiot. But that's not me. Check it. About to get the jackpot again. I lose. That cheated. I shouldn't have gone for it. Wait, I wait, that's totally true. Hang on, I just saw something crazy. I gotta try this again. Uh, you get three strikes. Once I get to the end, I, can, I haven't taken any strikes yet. I can just stand still until I get a freebie. Because the, the surface, it's a small enough thing where eventually I'll just get a freebie. That I won't have to move for, and then I'll win automatically. This is the easiest game in the whole thing if you can get to the jackpot stage. If I survive the jackpot without losing it, then I win. Right? I win. At that point, I win. It's the perfect game, dude. I tell you, it's got a little something for everyone. Don't go for that. Let it fall. Stay right there. Okay, the game, ch that, that, all right, that, that time, the game fucking threw some bullshit at us. That time the game threw some bullshit at us. It, it, this one really makes you feel like drop. Feel, it, it really makes you feel like the, the block. 
No way did I just lose the first one. Okay, that's not good. This game really makes you feel like pile. Am I choking? Nah, I'm gonna win. Watch, I'm gonna win off of this. Watch this. I want you to watch. I want to use your eyes and watch, okay? Because I'm about to win off of this. The whole thing. Check it. Okay. Check this. Watch the whole thing. Don't take your eyes away from this. Whoa, whoa! <laughs> Stop looking at me! Stop! One more. One more. Just one more game. Just one more game. What's one more? This is a fucking real screw up. At least I can't be doing as poorly at this as I would at, at, at oh my god. Hang on, I'm, I'm gonna minimize chat for a minute. I'm, I've minimized chat. Right now. Legend comes to life. Leave. Leave. Hmm. <laughs> I was better when chat was absent. I can win. I can win. I can win any day of the damn week. As long as chat's not there to get in my goddamn way. Stay gone. Watch this. Watch this. About to blow your minds. Get ready to be mind freaked. Get a helmet on, your mind is gonna be blowing all over the walls. I can go AFK for this. I'm going AFK. Please. God, God, God! Strat, dude, the last phase is RNG. We've seen this. We just watched it multiple times. The last phase is complete RNG. You just have to get lucky on the last block. <laughs> Gamer rage. Look, dude, I don't know what the sound was I made there, but I was processing a lot of immediate emotions I don't want to talk about. A lot happened to me in like a half a second. I want people to think I'm the best. And if I'm not constantly the best, I'm the worst. Please, please, I need to be the champ. Come on, give me the W. Why, why? Dude, I'm gonna lose all my money. I can't do this anymore, I gotta get some Ws. Get away from me, why are you all watching? Why are you all watching me? No, 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 that one costs too much. No, 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 I know it'll make me money. Activate hacking eyes, activate my cheating eyes. It's a th it's three. He's back in it, baby. 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 Get the hell out of here. Give me my money. He's back in it, baby. Wait, why don't I just go back to the fucking shooting gallery? That was not that much. And I was actually really good at that. That was $2 and I made 
920 tickets. Activate hyper aim mode. Bada bing, bada bam, fast as the wind. All right, the wheels are the best things to aim at. Don't even aim at the other parts. Wheels are the best. So what's this one? 15 shots for $2 on this one. What's this one? Rat dead. Boom, boom. Boom. When do I get a... Do I get like bonus points if I do that? Am I timed? Nito, 10 whole tickets. This is all, is most of this just funny sounds? It seems like the only thing worth clicking on is the one that gives me extra tickets. Why would I not just do this one 18,000 times? I know in like reality, this would be considered the more difficult of the ones to do. But like, for me right now, I can't fucking miss. I have a mouse. My aim will never falter. Hang on. Shit, so that gets me 75. Yeah, what does this give me? And now I'm at 565. I missed it. All right, so which one is, is the most valuable thing here? 615, how much is the rat? How much is the rat on the roof? Rat is a hundred tickets a pop. So you're telling me if I perfect hit the rat every single time, I would get... If I hit it, which I'm now never going to hit it. Okay, that's one. It's a, The rat's a hundred tickets a pop. But also arguably the most difficult thing here to hit because it's a slight, it's slightly moving. What else is here that doesn't move? That's 50. This is a. Mm. But this was this over here. That's also 50. Rat definitely pays the best. You have to hit it while it's moving. Which is. Not better than just doing the one over there. I mean, I'm pretty consistent with that one. This will never. This will sometimes be better. I think the best way to do it would be to hit that and then hit the rat whenever it goes by. Which I gotta not. I keep missing the rat like a fucking idiot. There it is. 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 It's not bad. Uh, I would say this is possibly the least fun thing I've ever done at an arcade in a digital video game. And I will never do it again till the day I die. My tickets. Oh my god. All I gotta do is get one jackpot on Mega Drop Ball Extreme and I would have a billion trillion dollars. 
I just gotta do one. Please. Why is the mega drop so high though? Because it's mega drop, not little idiot drop. It's supposed to be high. Why are you complaining about the one mechanic that makes it different from normal ball drop? It's mega drop extreme. This one's for adults. All right, kid. This one's for grown men. And women. Really anything. You could be a grown rhino. And I'd say you're allowed to play Mega Drop Extreme if you wanted. If you came in, you were just a big walking rhino, I'd let you play on it. Honestly, if a rhino walked in here, I'd probably would I'd probably run. Come on, Davey! There it is! There it is! There it is! He's the champ! He's back! He's back! He's not done yet. Never satisfied. He's got two more balls. He's not washed up, ladies and gentlemen. Not by a long shot. 50. My hands hurt from clapping. My hands hurt. Am I dying? What's another jackpot to add to the pile? Yo! <laughs> That's a small jackpot, though. It's only worth $500. It's nothing. It's nothing. But that's 4,000 tickets. Which, of course, puts me in the top 100 gamers. Okay. For a Mega Drop Extreme. Okay? Don't you ever forget it. Don't you ever forget it. I'm one of the best. I'm one of the greatest. Don't look me in the eyes if you walk by me. All right, ever. I litter. Slash litters on the ground. Slash me, litters. Then it goes over to Octo Swirl, one of the, one of the most critically panned games in the entire genre. Like, this is actually, like, this is second only to the other really shitty game in this place. Truly a miserable experience. <laughs> Believe it or not, that wasn't worth anything because it was on two separate spots. The only good thing about this game is the music. That won't count as anything. Yep, that didn't count as anything. Every time I play that one, it makes me sad. Like, playing that game actually makes me sad. Didn't you make a billion off of Octo game last time? No, I absolutely did not, and I can tell you that 100%. Uh, check this one out. Everyone shut up for a second. I'm trying to play the game. It's as simple as that, baby. It's as simple as that, baby. It's as simple as that, baby. It's as simple as that. It's as simple as that. And that's why I'm one of the top 200 gamers. All right, for pile up. Don't you ever forget it. I don't even want the tickets. No one would dare touch those tickets. I'm gonna play the scary game again, but first I'm gonna mute it so it doesn't scare me. One, two, three. 
I don't think... I don't think that game is for me. I'm more of a pile-up guy. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of a pile-up uh, gamer. I play pile-up. I'm not really into the whole, um... I'm not really into the reaction stuff. No, I got two dollars. I'm gonna do it. With the music. Watch. Combo craze. I am uh, actually retiring from combo craze. A lot of people have been wondering for a while if Tomatoes got what it takes to, <laughs> to do combo craze. And rather than talk about combo craze, I'd like to instead talk about my many high scores and accolades I've collected over the years. Um, most of these games have a high score uh, obtained by me, Tomato Gaming. I just like to remind you all of that. Take a look at how many tickets I have. 10,000. I made 10,000 tickets today. 10,000. Don't you ever forget it. Ahoy, matey. What can I get you from this fine establishment? God, it's gotta be fucking demeaning to come into work every day and have to talk like that. What was your hat say? Yarcade for life? Yeah, it's about all the joy and fun I needed here. I'll use my tickets elsewhere. That's just sad. I'm going, uh, I'm gonna go check out, uh, Berries, what's actually in today. Praise the bills. <laughs> Praise the bills. I've had enough of survival mode. I want to actually play some of these games. I don't want to worry about the money. I'm going back in on normal. I've had enough! Uh, it's my birthday today! Normal! Didn't save? Who fucking cares, dude? The survival mode is genuinely just a fucking time-wasting distraction from the point of the game, which is to play the games. When it's finished, I might do it again. But it is nothing. Yeah, it's really nothing. And it's my birthday. Scratch cards? No. But now I can actually play games without saying this isn't worth the money. Happy it's not my birthday. I was lying. You know I gotta play stack them up. This is another game I'm actually shockingly good at. Actually, this one I kind of suck at. I'm not a fucking pansy. The champ! The fucking champ! Give me my fucking prize! Give me my prize! Right now! I'll be taking that one. The champ! Oh, fuck. <laughs> I think they're broken. Headphones! Tomato's good at every game. The only games I'm not good at are the ones where there's literally no skill involved, like pulling this thing. I can't be good at this one. It's not physically possible. If, ain't, if I get a good points on this, it's because it was an act of God. I got 40. God is absent. He's not here. Oh, this is where they sell uh, the do. Ain't new stuff in this place? I don't think so. Oh, look at that Mega Drop Classic, baby. You know, this is a, it, it, you get a, little, a much lower amount of money playing this one, but this one, this one I've got, I, I'm used to. This one I've got, you know, I've played a lot longer. This one I've got more practice in than uh, Mega Drop Ultimate Omega Extreme, you know? Kids game. What? Just fucking say. Uh, 
Look at that, you pissed the ball off. It tried to get you. Isn't that a little scary? They tried to break the glass to kill you. Baby drop. You want to spell words? I just made 337 tickets like it was nothing. How long's this one been here? This one's been here forever. Cuckoo coins. Has this always been here? I don't remember. I don't remember cuckoo coins. Hold up. Got some fucking coins. Now the question is, is this better than the volcano? Probably. Probably, yeah. No. No, absolutely not. We'll have to see at the end, because I put in $10 into both, and at the end of the $10 on one of them. Oh, no way is this better, because you have to wait for the coin thing to like pop up properly. Yeah, no, this one's uh, terrible. This is nowhere near the volcano one. Let's get another spin, though. Maybe we'll be lucky. Another 30. Yeah, this one sucks. This one, this is a bad game. Unless I get really lucky, like that. Is that another 15? Yeah, no, this one's, uh, this one doesn't do it for me. Man, I did not need this many credits. I just didn't. Give me a thousand. Five. That made me, like, actually mad in real life to get five there. Got the vape pen. Did I get a- did I win a vape pen? Hold up. Yo, did I win a vape pen? Yo. Wait, did whose coins are those gonna be when they fall off in like one second? The populace? I made a hun- I made a- how many tickets was that? 186. Okay, yeah, I, uh... I shake these machines IRL. Well, what I do is I do the East Coast Classic, which is I take a fucking, uh, I take my foot to it and I kick the glass in and then simply take the coins. Uh, no one would dare stop you. It's how we all do it out here. Um, the arcades are, uh, real disasters out here on the East Coast. Uh, we kick the fucking glass open when it's, when it rips us off. Like insane maniacs. Y'all wanna see ball drop, baby? We got the ball drop! That kid runs over immediately because he knows. See that? Look at that. Look at the speed. Not gonna miss one. Not gonna miss one. <gasps> There's lag! I'm getting lag! Did I miss one? How did I? Huh? What? Ah! Did one glitch out? Did we lag? I didn't see one fall. I had my, I had something in my eye at one point. It was sort of following the heart of the cards. Uh, but I didn't see one fall out. So instead of getting uh, the jackpot, I won 50 tickets. How the fuck? Could my game lag dropping balls? Quit, just quit it out. Quit out, quit out of the game. Just drop everything, quit it. Just reset. I have to win or else people will think I'm a fraud. Just quit. Quit the game. Quit the game. It's because of my PC chat. My PC's smoking. Some uh, someone poured mozzarella cheese all over my PC and it's on fire. I gotta I gotta leave this one. It's just not. It's too much. Too much. It's too powerful uh, right now. I can't make it work. It's just not gonna happen. 
Hack fraud streamer. I'm not a fraud. My 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 PC's covered in cheese. And uh, it's just not fucking working. I'm sorry. Someone cheesed my PC. I'm going back to one. I'm going to the. Uh, I'm going to One Eyed Billy's. One Eyed Billy's, I think, is the premier arcade zone now. Yeah, someone. Someone cheesed my PC. God. Thanks for always watching out for me. Thanks for keeping it real. That's a 10 from me, baby! I know. Thanks everyone for believing in me. One night, Billy's. Here we are. It's time to play the bad games and win them too, like all the others. I've come for you, combo craze. You've made me look like a fool with bad reflexes 18 times in front of my chat, and it won't happen again. Why? 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 What's wrong with my body? 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 Down here with the other rejects. <laughs> Down here with the other rejects. <laughs> on the leaderboard that can't break fucking 15 on combo craze. I'm a fuck up. No, I got it this time. Someone's banging things upstairs. He's. I was starting to believe. That is one of, this might be the worst game. For tickets? This might be the worst one. I got 32 tickets from that. Did you see that lag? That's why I'm failing. The game's lagging. I physically, I'm a, I'm a pile guy. I'm not a uh, combo guy. All right, some people are good at, po at combo craze because they got like chameleon eyes. I'm good at fucking pile up because I've got like, I've got, uh, I've got an architectural, like, I've got a brain that can handle like architecture and like gra like distribution of gravity and weight. I'm not good at combo craze. I'm not a combo guy, but watch, but watch, but watch this. Let me show you something. Let me show you something. Let me show you something. Everyone get the fuck out of my way. No one stacks them like me. Okay? No one piles them up like me. No one. No one. He's gonna beans it. I will if you don't shut the fuck up, because you're distracting me. Whoa, whoa. The heck? Everyone jokes aside, what the heck just happened there? Did you see that? 
You know, some people are pile guys, some guys are combo guys. Me, I'm a pick your treasure kind of guy. Pick the color, get your treasure. It's gonna be landing on... It's gonna be landing on a, uh... I don't know. Blue. <laughs> I guessed it. It's blue. I'm gonna go ahead and put this one on a uh, white. It's gonna land on white. And that's gonna be 500 tickets. And then if this was the East Coast, I would smash the bottom of my fist into the glass right now and shatter the fucking dome. And then kick it over. And then steal the ball. And like eat it or something. That's how it happens on the East Coast. Okay, that's how arcades happen on the East Coast. Just poof, break, smash it, grab the ball, eat it. Like eat it like an apple in front of everyone. And then people start cheering. Watch it. We all know what time it is. It's time to see if this game's actually broken or not. Well, the first thing I notice when I play this one is that it lags. My game's FPS starts to panic. Mmm. I do believe this one might be the worst game in the entire fucking video game. That was... Okay, here's the only thing I can think of. Target a spot that doesn't have a lot of fucking bullshit on the ground. Right? There we go. If you aim at a spot that's not covered in crap, one of the claw hands can actually, like, do something. How many tickets did I get for that? I'm sorry, did I get nothing? You're telling me these golf balls have no value. Oh, the golf balls are just golf balls. This is an awful, awful game. So in the East Coast, this is one where I would um gra like immediately grab like a t this table here and you'd smash the glass open. And everyone start cheering. Then you push the balls all over the ground and people would like fall over, and like it'd be funny. It'd be fun. It'd be a fun game because of that. Yeah, that's what would happen on the East Coast. <laughs> Second, that bullshit happens one time. Some rowdy kid is punching a hole through the glass. You guys think I'm joking? Like, that's the funny part. Like, it, <laughs> I have been to some crazy arcades when I was younger. Okay. Dude, that game is not open for very long. And that fucking aquarium wouldn't be allowed to exist. Because some kid would be like, yo, you guys want to see something funny? And just like break the glass of the aquarium killing every poor fish in there for like a funny laugh. It was psycho hour every day Anyways, I'm gonna get jackpot on the mega drop, baby Friggin Hampton Beach arcades there it is. I was what? That's exactly the place, dude. Oh, yeah, there it is. There it is. Someone got it. Hampton Beach Arcades, dude. That place is fucking rowdy. <laughs> that place is rowdy. There it is. Sink it. Sink it. You, I, 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 I've seen brawls happen over games in the arcades of that place. That place was a wasteland. It was incredible. <laughs> Uh, I used to go there like every summer or every like other summer when I was younger, way younger.
Good times. Good times. Real good times. Though I wasn't really into the ticket game. I was more into the... I knew better. So I played games where, like, you didn't get tickets. You just had a fun time playing the game. Even when I was younger, I knew better. So I would, like, play the fun games. Like, oh, man, I remember this one really good fucking arcade game when I was a kid that I played all the time. It was, like, this canoe game. Does anyone know what I'm talking about? You'd play... You could play with a second person. It was, like, this canoe. You're, like, kayaking. Someone's gotta know what I'm talking about. Some people know. They know what I'm talking about. That if they just said, oh yeah, I know the canoe game, the paddling game, you'd paddle. Pissing me off today, chat. <laughs> just live like a zero to a hundred. You're pissing me the fuck off. But not know not knowing things like this is really I'm gonna have to do i I'm gonna have to do a round of pile to like calm down. Yeah, I'm fucking done. It's over. It's back on, baby. Check it. Check it. It's coming. Super bonus. Oh, yeah. Sink it. Oh, yeah. What can I say? I'm the streamer. What can I say? I'm the streamer. Now, there's only one game that's eluded me. And it's getting the Omega Jackpot and Pirate Plunder. Let's get that Mega Jackpot bonus. Okay, this one might take longer than... This one might take a while. Wait. Okay, I actually don't know. Statistically, I think it's fucking impossible to get to the bottom of this thing. Did he try the boats yet? Well, no, because I thought they would be a ripoff when I was playing on survival mode. But I'll go check them now that I'm not playing on survival mode. Because they likely were a ripoff in survival mode. But now I don't have to play for survival. Let's see here. Well, so, uh, what do I, uh, what do I, what do I do? I see, I collect these, uh... This one gonna get fun soon? This one gonna get, uh, it's gonna get fun? Someone said if I was gonna play this one, I have another minute and a half of this, huh? Uh, I'm looking around for the fun on this one. Uh, I don't think so. Not when you can hear the sound. Not when you can hear the sound of Omega Ball Drop Supreme. Like, right behind you. Like, what the fuck? How are you supposed to... I'm not gonna fucking play that garbage. Not when, it's, not when this is right behind me. Not when the, the, the allure of the jackpot. Of the big money W is like right behind you. It's just not gonna happen. It's just not, it's never gonna happen. This is the game of kings, Jack. This is the one, this is the best one in the whole goddamn arcade. I wish it went a little bit faster though, because honestly, you put as much time in this as I have, watching this ball slowly, very slowly go into one of these holes, gets old. All right, the magic of that is gone. The only thing I care about is the money. All right, I don't do this for the fun of it. I do it for the cash uh, gain. There it is, big money, $30, big money. Big money, $30. Come on, let's go, let's go, $30. Let's go, one more round, one more round, $30. It's as simple as that, baby. It's as simple as that, baby. It's as simple as that, it's as simple as that. It's as simple as that. It's as simple as it. I kind of feel like doing it again. 
It's as simple as that, baby. It's as simple as that. Ladies and gentlemen, it's as simple as that, baby. It, 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 it's as simple as that. I just don't know what to say. Uh, I could go for another, for like, 500 points from the uh, question mark. Plazongus, as simple as that. Let's drop one more ball and just see. Maybe we'll get some lucky. Yeah, I could go for it a fucking fifth time. <laughs> no, surely I don't. Surely I don't. That'd be unbelievable. But I could go for another question mark. Go for another 500. This drop me some kind of record. There's no, like, who has gotten the actual largest amount in one game. And I feel like I'm in, like, the top 100 for that. I just got six... I just got 6,652 tickets in one game. Chat. In one game. That's got to be a record. That's got to be up there. That's got to be way up there. Two jackpots back-to-back. -back and two bo... Whoa, dude, you good? Bro? Yo, Speedy? Too bad they're not playing survival mode. Yeah, but what am I surviving for? You know? That's the thing. I'm not sure what I'm surviving for. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow, cool. 30 tickets really feels good. Let's do one more giant combo craze. I'm getting better at this. here with the rejects like mayo chicken <laughs> down here with the other rejects fuck you I don't even want these I'm throwing these in the water <laughs> went over to ball drop omega I hate you. I'm never playing the mini golf. I played it last time I streamed this and it was awful. But I will play one round of Ticket to Bargain because Ticket to Bargain is one of my favorite games. <laughs> this one sucks. I that's an instant full game over you have to do a full like please redo if you miss one coin Cool, you know how much is this per game? <laughs> I want 15 tickets. How many what, how much is it per game? Is it a dollar a dollar for a game? Let's go baby ticket to bargain baby Woo, dude fuck yeah dude love ticket to bargain Fuck yeah Love Ticket Toboggan! Cannot get enough a Ticket Toboggan! It's $15 in the box! Alright, so we... Look, I think we can all agree one thing about One-Eyed Willie's... Um... Arcade Zone. It's got a lot of S-rank games. Unfortunately, the games that aren't S-rank are fucking Z-rank. And they're just, like, fucking terrible. Alright? Z rank game. I wouldn't. I, I wouldn't even put this in a prison to punish evil doers. I, I wouldn't even dare to do that. Z. It's Omega Z. S. S plus. C. 
ass. That, I say, this is, I'm not good at this one, but this is like a classic. This is a classic arcade game. All right, this is classic. It's classic. It's classic. It's classic. It's classic. Uh, I don't even want to give this a letter grade because then it would maybe think that it's worth something at all. I don't want to give it a letter grade because I don't think it's worth something. Um, I hate basketball. Z. S plus plus plus. This is the best one in the entire fucking arcade world. Ball drop, baby. I don't even want to look at Cash Claw. This is a claw game. It's just a claw game. It doesn't mean anything. Who put these here? <laughs> Spike it. Hate basketball. You mean you suck at it. Nah, basketball is just not fun. I don't like basketball. It's got so many stupid fucking rules. The thing I don't like about basketball. Chat. In every other sport, if I go up to someone and try to take the ball away, no one whistles. <laughs> In basketball, there's like all these things you have to do when you get it, and things you can't do when you get it. In every, almost every other fucking game, I, I get it, and I just get to do the thing. I don't know. I played soccer. I, 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 there, I could just push someone over, beat the sh like kick them, stomp all over them, then grab the ball, and I, no one would fucking bat an eye. But if I like approach someone and even get in their way at all in basketball, I get yelled at. I want to be. If a sport doesn't let me maim the person, I barely want to even look at it. All right. Hockey's pretty cool. Okay. If a sport doesn't let me basically destroy someone if I go at them fast enough, I don't want to look at it. I don't like it. I'd like hockey if I could see the puck. Okay, but I got slow eyes, and the puck disappears the second it touches the ice. Poof! It's gone, and there's just a bunch of big guys running into each other. I think that is the point of the game. I, think, I don't think anyone ever knows where the puck is. I think you just assume that someone has it because of the direction of all the bodies. That's what I've always assumed. You know? But yeah, nah, basketball I think is a miserable piece of shit sport. I'm sorry. I know a lot of people like basketball, but I think there's like a thousand better sports out there. I'd rather play bowling than basketball. <laughs> At least in bowling, once the ball's in my hand, all I have to do is roll it down the thing. There's no bullshit. I don't have to like dribble it or do some weird like any crap. I just roll it and it's donezo. Bowling's a classic. What about baseball? <laughs> baseball is the most boring. I'd rather, I'd hang out with basketball every day of the goddamn week before I fucking got near baseball. Oh my God, baseball sucks. Baseball sucks so bad. It's actually fucking boring as shit. To watch. Playing it. Playing baseball with friends is honestly pretty fun. But watching it? Oh my god. Mini golf, mini golf. What the fuck are you talking about, mini golf? No one's gonna no one's out here saying mini golf isn't fun. Everyone likes mini golf. It's the more fun version of golf where, the, where everyone actually like gives a fuck. Now imagine if they made an actual golf course that had mini golf tier, uh, like obstacles. Wouldn't that be awesome? Like a real sized golf course, but it's got fucking like, ha like real hazards. People like mini golf because it's wacky. You get funny stuff happening, like funny loops. Isn't that just Mario golf? I'm talking about real life, nerd. <laughs> Hi. We're talking about real life, dude, not fucking video games for one second, dude. Dork. I want someone to fall into a pit of acid. And that just be something that happens. What about kickball? No one. Look, dude. Kickball sucks. Kickball sucks. Same way all these other, like, half sports suck. 
Dodgeball, S rank. The only people that don't like dodgeball are the people that are too weak to play it. That's right. I'm gatekeeping it. I'm gate. I'll gatekeep dodgeball any day of the week. Anyone complains about dodgeball? It's because they were one of the people that was scared of it. All right. The people that like dodgeball were the people that were like that weren't afraid of the ball and would just fucking destroy each other. Whenever I'd play dodgeball in school, it would be like three, like fucking ten people wailing on each other, and then like twenty people that were like standing in the corner watching like you were insane as you just be like spiking balls into people's throats. I loved it. Frisbee golf? I was never good at frisbee because I couldn't throw the- I, I'm not good at throwing frisbee. My frisbee would always be the one that would like fly off in a like a million miles away in the wrong direction. I was never good at frisbee. I have a mean overhead throw, but I'm not good at like frisbee. But yeah, Chad, it's been four hours. That means I legally don't have to be here anymore. And I got some stuff I gotta take care of for tomorrow's stream. So, it's been a pleasure, it really has. But that's all the coin game I got in my tank for tonight. He's leaving. I am. Yeah. It's been a pleasure, Chad. And thus, 2021 ends. I ain't gonna miss you. This year sucked. <laughs> this year was beans. I'm not gonna miss it. Be gone, not like any of that stuff matters. The concept of missing a year or a year leaving and another one coming in are meaningless. It's not real. It's exactly one day later as of tomorrow than it was today. That's all it is. And I will see you tomorrow. Don't take it away from us. Look, dude. 2022 is gonna suck just as bad as 2021 and 2020 did. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> it's gonna be beans. Shut your dirty mouth. Shut up, Poro said. <laughs> Yeah, we'll see. Yeah, we'll see. The only good thing half of us have to look forward to is like some of the games coming out this year. Seem like they might be okay. But even that's not a guarantee, is it? Never be optimistic about anything. Never look forward to anything and then nothing can disappoint you. Don't you see? I'm trying to lower your expectations so you'll be so much more excited when good things do happen. Dang, man. Wait, is Among Us 2 coming out in 2022? Hold up. Pause. Pause. Pause everything. Are you for real? You being honest with me right now? You're not playing around, are you? Stalker 2 2022, at least. That game is going to suck. I, I I don't know how many more times I gotta tell you about Stalker 2 sucking, but it's gonna suck. And if it doesn't, you can grab this clip and I'll laugh about how wrong I was. Uh, but that game is gonna suck. Um, and it will only by the help of uh, fans that mod it and fix it for the devs will it be good. They tried to put NFTs in the game. That's all I have to say. <laughs> They tried to they tried to put NFTs in it. That game is gonna suck. That game is gonna suck. Oh god! Oh god, it's gonna suck! Go to Ukraine and tell them to not to make it not suck. Chat, why not just go to Ukraine and go to Chernobyl and like, I don't know, take a picture of you licking the, like, the, the big blob of radioactive ooze in that basement. Go and lick the elephant foot. Go find the elephant. Go find the, go find the foot. Take a picture of you like licking it or something crazy. Get a crazy picture for 2022. <laughs> take a picture. 
I'm going on a quest to find the foot. That's my re that's my New Year's resolution for 2022 is I'm going to find the foot. Doesn't like looking at it fuck you up? Yeah, like years ago. I'm pretty sure, and I, I I'm almost positive I'm also wrong, but um the radiation of that foot has gone down quite a bit. As in, I don't think you would uh, die within 30 seconds. But it's still definitely absolutely dangerous, and you shouldn't go anywhere near it, it'll probably kill you. But I don't think it would uh, kill you in a minute. But it will still kill you. But you might get to take the picture and post it on social media before it does. And really, that's the W in it. You know? It's still super hot. Oh, then put some water on it, dude. Just get it some ice. Hey, guys. Doing a TikTok challenge. I'm going to be stealing the elephant's foot from Chernobyl. I'm trying to get it past customs, dude. You try to get it past customs. Devious lick. Pretty sure that's a war crime. You gotta just pull the word war crime out for any naughty thing someone does. Like, it, it's not a war crime. It's an unbelievable play, but it, it's no war happening over the elephant's foot in Chernobyl. <laughs> it's, uh, it's just a crime. It's not a war crime. It's just a crime. All right, chat. I'm out of here. I will see you tomorrow at 3.30 p.m. ish EST. If you gave me money or donated bits or anything like that, thanks. I appreciate it. It's been a pleasure, as always. I don't know what I'm playing tomorrow, but uh, it should be a good time. I've got some stuff. I got this big list of things. Didn't want to do any of them today. All right. I'll see you then. And then Sunday is D&D. &D. Sailwind is not going to be Sailwind. I've already done five streams of Sailwind on my alternate channel. We're not doing any more Sailwind. I just can't. I've streamed so much of it. All right, I'm going to go stream Sailwind on my other channel. I'll see you all later. Goodbye.